This is not quite right. <laughs> is it right? Ah, yes, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Must be the outside light messing things up. Oh shit, speaking of outside light. Hi, Shitty. Speaking of outside light, um, let me do this here. There we go. This is actually a life hack. Because if I pull my curtains, I can see the screen of my phone reflected on the window. Which means that if it lights up, I'd be like, yo, there's something happening. Because I can't see that right now. Because it's, uh... It's, um... Using the back camera. Make me regret I ever watched that movie. Which movie? What movie was it? Why are they advertising movies? That's kind of strange. Oh, Godzilla vs. Kong. Gotcha, gotcha. I haven't seen it. It's out on Blu ray. Wow! Hi, toy. Like, I give a fuck? Well, you could give a fuck, you know? If you were a real hardcore Godzilla vs. Kong fan, you would want to purchase at least 10 Blu-ray copies of the movie. So you could build a fort out of the boxes and role-play as your favorite character, knocking the buildings down by knocking down the fort of Blu-rays. But it's okay. It's hard to be a, a fan of franchises in in this capitalist reality. I haven't purchased a movie like dude same fucking who buys movies? So weird. So goddamn weird. Seven C's, matey. Hell yeah. Um, so is a cute helmet now? I mean, sure, sure. Do you want to be a cute helmet toy? Is that is that what you're role playing as? Wait, Kaicho? Wait, what? What happened? Huh? Huh? Oh, Jesus Christ. Yeah, that is kind of scary. Holy shit. Anyway, uh, sorry, give me a second. I need to do the usual stuff. Get everything up and running. Uh, ping the Discord. Everyone. Ping the Discord. Hello, Coomers. Um, guys, I think Narbs is addressing uh, you. Um, but hi, Narbs. What's up? Good to see you around. How are you doing? Uh, I missed it. Were we on time? Kinda, yeah. I think so. Sorta? Relatively on time, at least. Uh... Wait! It says 90 plus people now on the server. Holy shit, when did that happen? Really? God damn. 90 plus people now. Pogger. Um, still gotta do it on Twitter. Hold on. Shall we? I am not uh, prepared ever. A couple of minutes later, I was about to die. I'm glad you didn't die. That's very good. Very good. Very good toy. I'm proud of you for not dying.
Okay, there we go. I need to change the color of when someone adds me. The color of when someone adds me. What? You can do that? I didn't know that. The fuck? Steam, come on now. I'm clearly connected to the internet. How could he be telling me that I'm fucking offline, bro? Get your shit together. The FFZ shit? Huh. Like... Does it, like, highlight the message in a different color? Is that it? Why the fuck do I have an origin process on my computer? I don't think I even have origin installed. Weird shit. Um... Give me a second, your guys. Uh, Steam is having a having a bad time, I guess. Okay, close and reopen. It's out of for certain words too. Interesting. Man. <laughs> mm -hmm. I open up. Uh, dude, listen. I open up fucking Steam, and this is what I see. This is what I fucking see, dude. I'll get to it. I'm not playing that on stream, by the way. I will 100% buy it, but I'm not playing that on stream. Uh, anyway. Where is Outer Wilds? There we go. All my hopes and dreams. Why would you want to watch me play Doki Doki Literature Club? What the fuck? I mean, like, especially because I've already played it. I, I would understand if it was like, you know, the element of surprise type beat, but... I already played it. I literally only know the meme, I never watched a single second of it. Oh, okay. Well, you're not really missing out on much. I don't even know what the game is about. Just. It's the dating simulator, you know? Perfectly, perfectly normal dating sim. Nothing at all out of the ordinary about it. <laughs> See big titty high schoolers now lose interest? Yeah, exactly. Just big titty high schoolers. Nothing, nothing out of the ordinary. Um, shit, wait, fuck, I closed something I wasn't supposed to. Uh, here we go. Da -da -da. Thanks, man. Alright. Wait, did I actually tweet? See, this is usually why I'm late. Because I do part of this whole process before I actually started, uh... Before I actually start the stream up. Um, anyway, yeah, I will be playing Doki Doki Plus, but off stream because it's a very special game to me. And um, yeah, I just, yeah. It's a very special game to me, so I'd prefer to play it by myself. Kind of, kind of like what happened with a um, with a replicant. At some point, I just got like, I can't, I can't keep playing this. I can't keep playing this on stream. It's like, I don't know. Sometimes the streaming like environment kind of kind of spoils the game's experience for me. It happens with some games. Uh, Replicant was one of those, and um, and Doki Doki would be one of those. Even though, actually, if you'd like, I do have a video. It's quite old. Um, 
but I do have uh, uh, the video of me playing the original. Uh, hold on. That it holds up the best dating sim. I'm 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 gonna be real with you. I really didn't like. I really didn't like the KFC dating simulator. Um. Like even as a parody, it was just. It was just. It was just. Uh, you know. I really didn't like it. But yeah, here you go. If you'd actually like to see me play the original Doki Doki, uh, there it is. It's like abridged. Talking about a tofu. That okay? No, that that's good. Even though I only played one round of it, it's it's good. I liked it. It's funny because I went into it, you know, with the intent of like, oh, funny. Uh, dating sim parody, fucking the birds and shit. And I went for fucking Nageki's route. And I finished it crying. So that was an experience. Uh, anyway. Fuck. I know there was something that I told myself that I was supposed to prioritize this time around. But I can't remember what it was. So we'll just have to, you know... Make it up as we go. Again. I always finish crying. I'm so sorry. But I mean... One could say that a uh, emotional... Response is, uh... Is is still is still good, even if it's a negative one. Grimmery, hello, how are you doing today? Uh. <laughs> okay. Let me see if I can remember. I think my next move was um. Was I getting set on the- on finding... My joke was about crimaxing, sir? I know. I'm aware. I have a headache and was on my way to go lay down, but I still wanted to come somewhere. I appreciate that, alright. I'm so sorry. I hope your head will feel better. Have a good rest. I appreciate you. <laughs> um... What I said still stands, Shinny. A negative emotional response? is still better than complete and utter apathy in my personal opinion um fuck okay wait let me check my log is there anything new here oops uh i don't think so okay I, I looked at everything i don't think that's really the negative I don't think that's related to a negative response, though. I don't really care about what we're talking about. <laughs> Thank you, Troy. Uh, you know? It's, it's good. Let me check the guys that cry Reddit. There's a Reddit for that? Alright. Thank you for the Lord, Cora. I appreciate it. Uh... Oh, gotcha. Apathy, gotcha. That is good. That was good. That was good. I just didn't process it immediately. I just... I had to go outside earlier. I went grocery shopping. So I'm still like... <sighs> you motherfucker. Okay, alright. I say all right, but I don't actually know. God damn it. Fuck. Okay. 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 I'll be trying to backtrack here.
We could try to find the quantum moon. We could go to the Amber Twin to find the clue about the fish in the fucking hentai planet. I think that's about it, actually. I think that's the two most direct things we could look into. I think there's a guy somewhere. Fuck, wait, no, we still have to... We still have to find the observatory entrance. Jesus! That, okay, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's the one. That's the one. We need to find the fucking... Uh... Observatory. Right? So... Quantum signal? Quantum signal? Quantum signal? What? Somewhere in the hourglass twins, timbers. Okay. Um. Wait, is that here? Anglerfish fossil. No. The vessel, right? Dude, what? Southern Observatory. That's it. The miners had to build a large South Pole. Uh, Rapids says they can't get there with the observatory from the surface. They tried, but there's probably a path to it beneath the crust somewhere. There's a door to the observatory on the surface, but it's broken. Right, 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 right. This is it. This is it. This is what we're going for. Complete, perfect focus. No getting sidetracked. Absolutely not. That never happens, and it won't happen today either. 100%. <clears throat> I do agree, Shinny. You are very adorable. And everyone loves you. Absolutely true. I'm very glad you can recognize it. Um, and I would never hate you, Troy. No one can. If they do, they're just incorrect. And that's honestly their loss. That JPEG. Good meme. All I heard is you agree with me. It's it, it can be difficult to face reality. So to avoid it is a perfectly understandable attitude. I I, I don't I don't blame you for it. It will not change the truth though. means a lot. You mean a lot to me, Troy. Um, so that's where we need to go. We need to find our way on the inside of the blue of that dome there. I think it might be helpful. It might be helpful if I... Oops. It might be helpful if I, like... Park my ship... On the surface near it. So I have, like, um... How you say, um... Like an indicator, you know what I mean? I guess I could put my scout here, too, but... Well... You know? I haven't faced reality since I turned 8. That's alright. It's it's difficult to, to find it to like... Orientation can be really fucked up. I can't use a compass. It weirds me out. So true, bestie. Alright. Um... Okay, so now we have the ship parked on top of the place we're supposed to get in. Now we're supposed to get in here through underneath. So we have to find a gap in a crust and go in through there because the outside is not open. There's a door that's broken. And that's it. That's all we got. That's interesting. We should get to zoom in more with this. That would be helpful, but... Oh well. We work with what we have. 
All right. Gamers, fellow scientists, explorers. It's time to duel. Um, wait, actually, I should I should say that when we go to the Ember Twins, get it? Because they're like twins. So it's time to duel, as in duel. As in not fight, but like two of them. That's pretty funny. I like that. Um, I was trying to see if there's like something, an opening close enough. But it doesn't seem like it at the moment. The fact that this sur this whole surface is like this weird jaggedy type of ground. I'm thinking it means it's going to fall as the cycle progresses, right? Is that light? No, I'm on crack cocaine. Very cool. Uh, and also Parrot and Docs were twins. So it ties them with both duels and duels. Fantastic! I didn't know there were that many characters in Yu-Gi-Oh. I thought it was just the one guy. With the pyramid on his neck. And that's it. No one else. It was literally a one-man show in my eyes. Bro, how am I already out of fuel? That's kind of a scam, to be completely honest with you. No? No oxygen? So no head? Kinda cringe. Everyone else is part of his fever dream. Exactly. Exactly. No, but I'm literally out of, of fucking fuel. How? And there's still no, like, nearby openings. Like, this is, a. Uh... Oh, wait. Hold on. I spoke too soon. I think this is the gravity cannon, right? Oh. Ow. Oh, okay. Wait, no. This is oxygen fueling. This is the tower of... Oh, Jesus. This is the tower of quantum knowledge. I remember. Why do we get it? This is sus. This is extremely sus. The fact that you can just like shoot here is very sus to me. Wait, I wonder... Shit. You know what? Fuck it. We're not getting it. We're not getting sidetracked. Nope. No siree. No sidetracks here. Absolutely not. However, um, I uh, am out of uh, fuel. Not cool. Not cool. Not cool. Did not anticipate this. I guess I go back to the ship then. For fuck's sake. Uh! Dude. Oh no. Oh no. I hate this. I fucking hate this. God damn it. How could this happen? Do I have to walk back now? This sucks. This fucking sucks, dude. God. Uh, why can't there be like a fuel recharge in the... Wait, maybe? I don't remember very well, but maybe there is? And I'm just stupid? I don't think so though, but maybe I can get to that uh, the crossroads from here. That would be nice. Some 
There I know for sure there's a refill. And I guess I could go from there to try and um to try and find the observatory. Oh wait, this is really helpful actually. Now I can see that weird cluster of fucking blue shits. Is where I'm supposed to go from beneath. Very interesting. How the fuck do you even find your way in through there? Very weird. Um, crossroads. Is this at a crossroads? You sure? Oh. Not smart. Oh, okay, yeah, I see. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I see, I see, I see. Okay, okay. Okay. We'll be okay, I think. Right. Here we are. Safe and sound. Hey, buddy, can I use your fucking fuel tank? Thanks, man. Love you. <laughs> Wonderful. Keep it up, buddy. You're doing fantastic in there. Um, okay. We need to go there. How? Literally, how the fuck do I make it there? If I go there, I'm like closer, maybe, kinda? Where's this? Jail. Fascinating kink, Troy. Horny jail, perhaps. That would be very ironic, wouldn't it? You get sent to horny jail, but that's exactly what you want. Being in horny jail facilitates your being horny. Um, honestly, I might just, I might just, I might, I might just jump for it, you know? I might just do a little jumping here. I don't think it will work, to be perfectly honest with you. But it's worth a shot. Heard horny, I was summoned. Good fucking god. You have, like, blended in here flawlessly. It's like you've been here all along. I swear. <gasps> yeah, that wasn't scary at all. No, no, sir. Okay, fuck it. Uh! On God? Really? Okay, but the good news is, I saw like... Um... I saw like... Paths there. I think there might be like some of those trails. Like in um... Like those uh, how you say, those like the little gravity stone things. Ow, what the fuck? That wasn't that harsh, man. Come on, relax. I think there might be some... There might be some of those. Ugh. There might be some... What am I trying to say? There might be some of those, like, paths on the... On the surface. On the funky little... Funky little rocks down there. So that's good. That's pretty good. 
Um, now the question is, how the fuck do we find a way to... Like, is there a beginning to a trail that leads to the place? That would be very nice. Why are couches so expensive? They are big. Uh, they have a lot of fabric. I'm sure they're very difficult to make. Um, and they're a scam, also. You know? You could just, you know, have your have your bed be a couch. That's what we do here. My bed's a couch. I'm on the other side of the fucking planet. God damn. Can they not be so expensive? Yes, I think. If you find specific places or perhaps buy them secondhand with like lice and stuff. It's interesting, isn't it? They'll cost less, but they'll come with extras. Extra living beings, that is. The lice. I use the casting couch. Did you get the part? I don't know if you use a bed as a couch. We need a new bed for the bedroom. Why? Just use the bed in the bedroom as a couch. Easy clap. What am I doing here? What am I hoping to accomplish here? The ground is gonna start falling while I'm standing here on top. And I'm gonna fall to the fucking hole again. And nothing in my living room. Exactly! It's the, um... Uh... How you say? The, the... Um, what's that one word, like, people use to... For, for like... Decoration. It's the, the, uh... Fuck, it's like, it's like... <sighs> minute. That too, that too. But I mean like, the, you know, that one, like, like, um... I think it's like an, uh, an Eastern word. F feng Shui, maybe? You know? I don't know. I'm trying to think if I know. That's, that's the one, Troy, that's the one. Right? You can't fuck up with it. If there's nothing to fuck it up. It's that simple. It's it's just that simple. Okay, so now we have some gaps. So true, bestie. Now we can actually see... Okay, dude, that's real cool of you. So glad that you just decided to... F okay, wait, I see them though. I see them again. How do you get there? Fuck. Are you just gonna sit on the floor and watch TV there? Yeah. Exactly. I mean, you can, like, maybe get it like a carpet or something. Am I dead here? No. Wait. Not by impact. I thought I was gonna die from the impact, but. Please let me in. Please let me in. Please let me in. Oh, thank you. Uh, when we get guests over- GUESTS?! What are those? Like, people? You would invite people to your house? That's very strange to me. You would invite family to your house? Bro, I would get like armed guards to keep family away from my house if I had my own. Maybe a couple of guard dogs? I would for sure not invite them in. I'd sooner invite a vampire. Which is funny because a vampire would respect my wish. And only come if invited to do so. Which... The same cannot be said about family. Those just waltz in. Uninvited. Um, this is getting more and more difficult to navigate as well. Dude, come the fuck on. That wasn't that hard. 
Moving 120 kilometers closer to Jay's farm, so they're gonna be here all the time. I don't know how I feel about it. That's. <laughs> Ill advised. But I mean, I can't. I guess not every situation can be perfect, everything has its downsides. That's the new segment. Like, okay, even if I can't make my way there, at least now we know that there's a kind of trail. Or something to guide us. Now, if only we could find kind of stuff. Okay, are you serious? On God? What the fuck am I supposed to get there now? I hate this planet. Fuck this place, dude. I wanna go home. Dude, I'm not going to jump again. 31% integrity? Really? How do you do this? Like... How do you land there? On such a specific point, it feels like you'd almost... Oh, already? Damn, alright. It, it really feels like... You would need... The ship itself to get there. You know? Hmm. Maybe there's like a fault in the surface or something that I could use to get in? Oh, this should be fun. We haven't seen the sun explode, like, just stranded in space. This should be interesting. Let's perhaps sit back and enjoy the show. I'm waiting for the daddy coming up surprise while I'm streaming. I mean, do they know that you stream? Because, like, Trying to enhance the experience. Emergency scout recall activated. Thanks, man. I don't think it's gonna help, but you know, I appreciate it. They do, but like every other adult, I don't think they know what it's actually like. Hmm. I mean. You could just try to make it clear that it's like something to not be interrupted or I don't know. Hi Emma! Out of wilds, yeah. How are you doing today? Have you have you played any games in the new season yet? Or that it's not welcome to just come and bursting while you're doing streamer things? Well, I think it might be maybe beneficial to try and explain the implications of coming in, right? Because it's like, maybe if they have the notion that there's like a ton of people watching, they don't have to know how many people are actually watching. But if you just like tell them that there's like multiple, you know, like there's like an audience, right? I think if they understand that, if nothing else, the embarrassment might deter them from, like, you know, interrupting. Um, 
right, right, okay, okay. We go again. Graphic, the graphics look sick. It's, um, like, it's very stylized, you know? It's very stylized. They're not, like, super, like, ultra, like, realistic and shit, but that, that makes it a lot more interesting. The game would lose a lot of its charm if it, if it wasn't, um, if it didn't look the way that it does. But yeah, like, look at it. Everything is like, okay, please don't, please do not fucking drive me into the, the tiny sun again. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, look at this. Tiny, tiny ass planets. I'm on my little scuffed ass ship right now. That's home right there. The home planet. Oh God. Oh, please. Oh. We good? We good. All right. Poggers. All right. Yeah, very, uh... We fly... We fly in space in this thing. <laughs> um... God, okay. Maybe I take, like, a, um... Closer look around... These formations make me really think that there might be a path somewhere. Like how there is, like how there is a cave entrance near the, um, near the, uh, where was it? Near the Hanging City, right. Um, hi Tarm! How you doing? Uh... And puts a BRBJ. Sally's doing things in the background screens. <laughs> desperate times call for desperate measures. This is so sus. This makes me really think that there's something here, like an entrance somewhere, an actual entrance besides the blocked entrance. It's funny also how you can see, it's kind of, this is kind of like how in cartoons you could see how when something was about, it was gonna like break, you know? You, this has the same effect, it's like you can tell that this is like the ground that's gonna start fucking breaking apart and this is the one that's going to stay at 100% stability the entire cycle. Um... What was I saying? I was, uh, fuck, I forgot. Did I ask everyone how you guys are doing? I'm sorry, I'm spacing out. <laughs> Funny! <laughs> spacing out! Get it? Because <clears throat> we're in space? <laughs> um. If there isn't, I'm not sure how to proceed. Because it would mean that... We gotta get in... To the core. To a farther point. Okay. That didn't hurt me somehow. Farther point. Man, I this shit gotta be broken, dude. These guys couldn't just fucking build their shit to last. God damn it. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, this breaks quickly. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Huge. Let me just refill, ref, ref. Refill my stuff. Fuel. Um. Something about cartoons. Right, yeah. Old cartoons would have things look rendered differently because you could tell that they were going to like explode or break apart or something. And this has that as well. Okay. This is cool, right? This is exactly what we want. 
but it would be cooler if we had a direct access to one of those funny little gravity stones that we know are in here. I think at some point I should probably like try to explain what the fuck is happening because I feel like I'm just like rambling. And someone coming in without any idea of what's going on might be a little bit confused. I can look from this angle. Doesn't seem like I can get anywhere from here. Tycoon in a bit. Thai, Thai, Thai cube. Why did I say it like that? Thai cube. I don't think I've. Have I ever had Thai food? I don't think so. How is it? Cube. Thai cube. Oh, wait. Hold on. Wait, no. Fuck. I'm stupid. Alright. It's just not, a, not an entry point. Just a, just a funny looking gap. Uh, okay, let's do another another run around the perimeter. If it is so good, is it spicy? Thai cube. <laughs> Why did I say that like that? <laughs> Uh, okay, wait, hold on. This is a different part. Fuck. Please let me in. Okay. Um, I hate this. I hate this fucking patch of fucking ice. Wait, that's, that's where I need to go. You guys see that purple light there? It's exactly where I need to go. How? Did I just make another fucking leap for it? Leap of faith. Leap of faith time, guys. This is Assassin's Creed now. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, please, please. Oh my god. <laughs> Uh, okay, 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 massive, huge, colossal, colossal gaming moment. Top 10 gaming moments. Number one, this shit right here. Uh, where do I go now? I... Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, I'm getting so disoriented right now. Holy shit. Um, uh, oh no. No, 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 no. I hate my life. Pain. Nothing but pain. <sighs> Give me a second here. Curry is good. I've, yeah, I've had Indian curry. Is it kind of like that? We got the curries all around over, but Thai food is not, uh, the kind of curry is like red curry. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. The spicier the better, damn. I'm very white, so I don't deal with spice very well. Oh, 
god, no, no, no. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Please, okay. All right. Uh. Come on. Just get it. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. I really thought you were just like a sauce, or spices, spices, and tasty as a bunch of chicken and different types of veggies. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. It already sounds like not my cup of tea, but. I can understand the appeal. Uh. Man, fucking navigating the station is becoming like muscle memory at this point. And I hate that every time I end up here, like, okay, 90% of the times that I end up here, it's on fucking accident. Mediterranean food. Uh, wait, does, does Portugal count as Mediterranean food? Do you like food? Um, not really. I like garbage, to be perfectly honest with you. I mostly like garbage. Um, fast food, not necessarily, but just food that's not really sensible for people to eat regularly. All I know is you eat ravioli. I do eat a, a fair bit of ravioli, for sure. It's very easy, especially since they invented the kind that you can just like put into the microwave and you don't have to like boil water to make it. Very cool, love that. Technology is amazing. Ravioli is odd? Wait, how? It's just like a bag of pasta with stuff inside of it. Ravioli is pog, I agree with that. I like pasta in general. Um, I hate this, dude. I fucking hate this. This plan is gonna make me lose my fucking mind. I s okay, okay, dude. Really? Really now? Really? Fucking really? Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Where's the- where's the crossroads? Oh fuck. Wait. Am I- I- oh my- wait, 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 gaming moment, gaming moment. Oh my god. Oh my god, holy shit. Actually, I should just do this more often. I feel like as soon as I lose my- uh, as soon as I lose my grip, and I fall down into the black hole, I kinda just give up. But I mean, look at this. We kinda just- Try to take it, use it to our advantage. And go to the uh, crossroads instead, which I think is always an option. First playthrough, cool. I'm very sorry if this becomes frustrating to watch. I've been playing this game for like... <sighs> How long has it been now, guys? It's been a- wait, let me check. I think I can just check on Steam. I have fucking nine hours in this game, and I feel like I've not made a lot of progress. <laughs> um, so it might be a little bit frustrating to watch, cause, yeah, my progress may be a bit slow. <sighs> Took three weeks to finish it. Damn. All right. Okay. It's a bit reassuring. I guess maybe I'm- um, oh, well, this is useless now. <laughs> Fuck. Ah, uh, okay, wait. Uh, pasta is good? Pasta is good. I love pasta. I like pasta meat uh 
cheese. Um, garlic. Uh, onions are cool. And that's like the, the main things I can think of. Wait, hold on. What do you mean by this? I've passed this fucking thing so many times, and if you're gonna tell me that this is telling me that I can get to the to the observatory from the gravity cannon and the fucking gonna lose it I'm gonna lose it sausage right um one of my favorite things ever one of my favorite dishes ever is a uh, pasta uh, carbonara and I like it in the both the scuffed way and the traditional way um which is very cool because I think it'd be kind of unlucky if like I only liked it in the traditional way uh, no backseating. I would appreciate it if there were no uh, backseating, yes. If I get really desperate, I, I probably would just like look it up online. So it's generally no backseating, yeah. But th thank you for checking. Uh, good luck at work. Hope you have a good stream. Thank you, Emma. Good luck at work. And appreciate the lurk. Uh, explain it two different ways. Um, the scuffed uh, popular one uses cream like whipped cream or something um it's very like milky and creamy and shit um and the original way or the traditional way doesn't it's like it's really weird because there's barely any sauce at all in the in the traditional carbonara it's it's like very um, uh it's like a time for bad it will happen a lot i think most streamers as a rule of thumb Backseating is usually not a good idea on streams, to my experience. Sometimes people are cool with it, but it's rare. Um, fuck. I guess I'm kind of like too late now to make it to somewhere. Perhaps, wait. Gravity cannon. Can I- wait, can I just fucking walk there? Probably not, right? Where is this gonna take me? Hi, Jay! How are you doing? Uh, oh, wait. Right, 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 right. Okay. See, this is good news, though. So give me a semblance of sanity. Gotta heat up my Thai cube. Good luck, Grim. I hope the process goes smoothly. Do you like lasagna? Yes, I do like lasagna. Although I feel like it's very easy to... Sorry, sorry! My bad, my bad, my bad. It'll be, it'll be, it'll be back in place in like, uh... Uh, two minutes, maybe. Um. Okay, Garfield. What do you mean? Stop projecting your furry. F fucking f furry uh, personification into me. Hi, Kaz. How are you doing? Ah! I'm alive somehow. I broke my legs probably, but you know, we made it. Uh, go check out a popular dear VTuber Toby Deer at twitch.tv forward slash Toby Deer. Um, <laughs> yeah, do that actually. Actually, do that. Um, okay, give me a second here. So according according to according to the according to the uh, cartography that we have discovered, uh, I should maybe be able to get to there from here. Wait, to there from here. Hold on, I think I understand how maybe. Uh, you said I like lasagna. That's like Garfield's thing. Okay, okay, dude. 
Okay, dude. Okay. And... Uh... Okay, and you know what? Shrek loves breathing air. Are you saying you're Shrek then? By that logic? Um. <laughs> Why Rip lied? I, it was an accident. It was an accident. I didn't mean it. Uh, Kaz I love Kazuha. I will kiss Kazuha directly on the lips. I love him so much. He looks so pretty, is so cool. I love the the fact that you can use the um, whoosh, the little boost skill midair. Was that supposed to be a comeback? What do you mean a comeback? I'm just I'm just saying that by your logic, you're Shrek. Shrek breathes air. You breathe air, so you're Shrek. Like a point of a point of, you know. Is all it takes? Kinda weak. Why am I Shrek? Because you breathe air, Grim. Just like Shrek. Makes perfect sense. I'm gonna put my finger through his boob window. That's so valid. That's so valid, Jay. Oh, you have to be. I'm kidding. Is this, is this how you're supposed to- wait. Wait. Uh, wait. What? What? Huh? Shit. I should have made it here earlier, shouldn't I? Ay, ay, ay. Agony. Pain. Wait, what? Oh, I guess I bumped into like a fucking rock or something by your logic we are all shrek by your logic you mean it was your logic i'm just saying we are by your logic we're all in the primordial fucking lcl soup from evangelion we're all one collective consciousness because we all breathe air Schrarfield. shard Booba. Booba. So true. So true. Oxygen breathes you? Alright, now now we're talking. Now we're talking. This is the pinnacle. I, lo I, I, I love how you, when you see your shadow and it's like... Mom said it's my turn on the Xbox. Um... Just got roasted. I would never roast my friends. Am I wrong though? How can I be roasted if I'm not wrong? By saying that we're all primordial LCL soup? I mean... Sure. If you stand by your principle, by the principles of the hypothesis you put forward, you're absolutely right. It's not a roast at all. It's just a confirmation of, of your of your of your logic. We are all one. Don't boo me, I'm right, you're absolutely right. I guess you really are Shrek. We are all Shrek. I breathe air, dude, same. So true, bestie. Okay. 
Okay, wait, but I'm stupid. Wait, am I stu- No, okay, I definitely am stupid, but... There's an entry... You can get to the gravity cannon from the surface. I remember that. For sure. Let me make sure that I'm pointing at the right thing. Uh... Yo. Bonk. Okay. Uh... Thanks. Get out me swamp! I breathe, therefore I wheeze. Oh my god, we're all Weezer, guys. We're all Weezer. Popular uh, K-pop band, Weezer. We are all them. Incredible. I've never seen Shrek. I've, I think, I've seen some Shrek movies. I don't think I've seen them all. Well, actually, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I know for sure I've seen the first one. Um, gravity cannon, gravity cannon. Here. Yeah. Oh no, that no, that's the tower. Um. Hmm. Wait, but didn't they say you can make it there from the tower as well? I think they did. I think they did. Wait, let me have a. Let's 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 have a little a little look see here. A little look see here. Ah! <laughs> Weezer. <laughs> so true. So true. Wait, Jay, have you not gotten a uh, Kazaha? Wouldn't it be funny if I spent literally all fucking stream trying to get to this one place and still not being able to make it? That would be very funny, I think. Through here? How? Oh. Wait, I think I've... Haven't I seen this before? Wasn't it uh, like a dead end or something? Huh? This doesn't look right. Unless... Fuck it! <laughs> you know? Sure. 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 I'll take it. Oh god, I'm gonna get fucking dizzy walking around here. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Can I make this jump? Bonk. Okay. 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 Oh. Good. Oh, I don't like this. Please. Okay. 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 Not okay. Not okay. No. What the fuck? Nice physics, buddy. Huh? Oh god. No. 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 You have to be shitting me, dude. Please. 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 No. Takes a <laughs> yeah, let me just snap a quick picture before I go down the fucking hole again. God damn it. I can't believe that just happened to me. I'm desolate. 
This is so tragic. Alexa. Play Dobby Pussy Indulgence. God fucking damn it. I swear to God. I've been here so often at this point I should like pay this guy pay these guys rent or something. Unlockers were ma were were making huge progress though. This is massive. This is colossal. Now we know that there's a path that you can follow. We have a clear thing to go at. Wonderful. It's wonderful news. Wonderful news. Shrek is love, Shrek is life, and love wins. Happy Wrath Month, everybody. Hmm... Can I still make it there? God, but now I have to make it all the- uh, I have to make that whole way again? Fuck's sake. I wish I could cheat. At some point, you can't even like take that path anymore. Also, because it's just, everything just starts falling apart. Hmm. Oh dear. Oh dear. Also, I accidentally recalled the scout. Because I shot the scout while I was panicking trying to not fall in the black hole. Very cool. Love to see it. Love to- what the fuck just happened? Alright, Tony Hawk, settle down. Okay, let's try that again, even though I think we might not be able to use this path anymore at this point. It might have deteriorated too much, but only one way to find out. I still see that one in the distance. But like, you know for sure it's not gonna stay there forever. Cause all the- cause this- this is all the um... All these bits- oh my- wait, what the fuck, hello? Jesus Christ! Alright, I guess I was- <laughs> What the fuck? Why was- why did I have my fucking turbo turned on? Jesus! I can broke several limbs there. Such a, such a, such a mellow, such a mellow leap the other time. And this time around, we just fucking slingshot it across the gap. Holy hell! Okay, wait, this isn't so bad actually. Okay, sure. Okay, and now we're safe, I think. I think. Now that I'm here. don't hate this game by the way I just hate hardships and obstacles <sighs> wait can I okay I think I'm okay I get it I get it I get it this is fine then Ooh. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, all right. What happened, bestie? You see these funky little, like, uh, spikes? You can't touch that. That kills you. And they fucking put that shit right in the... <laughs> path? Ah, uh, oh my god, I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. We made it. We actually made it, guys. We're actually making progress. Can I make it up there? Should I try to make it up there? The fact that there's like a path there makes me think that I shouldn't risk it. You know, like I, I could try to make the leap over there or I could try to go down here and see where this path goes, which I think might lead there. I mean, worst case scenario, well, worst case scenario, I die, right? Or I fall down the hole. <sighs> Fuck it. Okay, well, that was easy. Um, I hate that. I hate that. Please, let me in. Oh my god, we made it. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it, guys. We fucking made it. Holy shit. Ah, what the fuck? Why are you harvesting tornadoes? I like the music. There's so much here. What's all this? Uh, man. Man. There's so much here. Oh my god. I need like a whole cycle to fucking digest all this information. Epic gaming moments. This is it. This is top one. Number one epic gaming moment. This right here. We made it. We made it into the Southern Observatory, guys. We fucking made it. I wish you could just like open the door and it would stay open. So you didn't have to make that fucking way all the time. But I don't think that's a possibility. Unfortunately. Fuck this door. Fuck you. Piece of shit door. I mean, we did open it. Wouldn't it be interesting if because of all the funky, like, time stuff... Because we're clearly... Because we're clearly... Um... Affected by the technology. Or, well, we don't know that, but... Because whatever the whatever is doing the time loop feels like it has something to do with the furries, and because the furries built this place, maybe, maybe it could mean that that will stay open. But I'm not gonna I'm I'm not gonna have my hopes up. You know, it would be nice, but I guess we'll see. Kanoi, Daz, and I were lifting the orbital probe cannon components into orbit for for assembly, and one somehow sank down down beneath the current. Kanoi, you should have seen it. We thought it was impossible for any cannon components to sink even partially below the current, but ours sank straight to the core. Casanova convinced me not to try to recreate the phenomenon myself using the other cannon parts, but we're very curious to know what happened. How could something pass through the current? My gratitude for your interesting question. This is exciting. Spire constructed a bundle of giants deep here at the Brittle Hollow's Southern Observatory. A model of giants 
deep. And it reveals how an object might sink below the current. Could I be able to grasp the answer by looking through the projection pose? If I visit the observatory, would you kindly explain? If you don't mind the track beneath the surface through to the south pole, I'd be delighted to see the trailhead starts at Brittle Hollows, Ecuador. Wait, are they telling us there's a shortcut here? Wouldn't that be interesting? Alright. Start up the zoom call. Where do we... Okay. So this is Giant's Deep, which we have not been to, and clearly there's some water business going on in it. All this talk about currents and shit. And now we see this. Alright. Interesting. Good to know. Uh this is number two. Number one is Miku's number one victory royale. That's a good point. That's a good point. Seems safe completely. Casanova's construction yard has been using the cyclones on Jack. Using the cyclones on Giants Deep to lift orbital probe cannon parts into orbit. But one component was pushed down past the current that usually prevents anything from sinking. Spire and I are crafting a model to determine why this happened. An update. It's now clear that there are two different types of cyclone. There also exists a rarer type of cyclone that spins the opposite direction and pushes the objects but wait. Most cyclones in Giants Deep rotate clockwise. These are the cyclones Casanova typically uses to send components into orbit. Okay. There also exists a rarer type of cyclone that spins the opposite direction and pushes objects beneath the waters and below the current. My gratitude, Spire. Kanoi is showing me your handiwork. And I'm intrigued by the secondary type of cyclone. But it, was it really necessary to build a model to tell me that? The model will be useful as we continue monitoring Giant Steep. Also, I very much wanted to make a model. <laughs> Understandable. The respectable scientific pursuits. I get it. I get it. Alright. Wait, so are they safe to use? Oh, they... Wait, no. Wait, this is... The which one is which? I can't tell clockwise from... Okay, well, this is clockwise. And that's counterclockwise. Gotcha. It... Feels like the opposite, though. That looks... Okay, oh, you know what? I'm not gonna question it. Maybe they were wrong, also. But now we know that there's two different types. Ah, oh, fuck me, dude. Okay, and this is what we came here for. What have we learned thus far in our search for the eye of the universe? Here we go. Based on our knowledge of the quantum moon, we believe the eye is in orbit around this star's system sun. This would mean the eye is located within a finite, albeit enormous, range. Okay, wait, so it is relevant to go to the... Fuck me. Oh, no. Those of us on the vessel originally followed the eye's signal to the star system, but we were unable to warp to the eye itself. The locator we built on the Adarok 
and the new, more sensitive locator we built here were both unable to detect any trace of the eye's signal. Hypothesis. The eye has stopped emitting its signal. Suppose the eye doesn't wish to be found. How can you suggest that? The eye's signal called out to summon us to this star system. I'm aware I grew up hearing the eye's story, yet we're no closer to finding it than you were when we first arrived here. So... They weren't picking up anything here either. That sucks, man. They built a whole more advanced observatory. And it still wasn't working. How should our methods change as we continue to search for the eye of the universe? We know what the eye looks like thanks to the quantum moon. So what if we try to find the eye visually instead? Let's send out a probe. We'd need to build a probe launching mechanism to cover those long distances quickly. A cannon in orbit around the celeste... The gravity cannon that we see explode in the sky every time we start a new loop. Giant Zip would be a good choice. It's furthest from the sun, and so it would provide the best angles for launch, and it's moonless, except when the quantum moon is visiting. Yes, let's build the cannon in orbit around Giant Zip. It is! This is what they're talking about! As we couldn't find the ice signal using two different devices built for this exact purpose, we should discontinue this search method. Hi Jax, how are you doing? Yes, it is the Hentai Planet game. Mallow's idea is clever, but we have no idea where the eye is in relation to here. The probability of launching a probe in the correct direction would be absurdly small. I believe I have a solution for that problem. Have you spoken with Raimi and Pi about the technology they're developing? Raimi and Pi? These names sound unfamiliar even to me. This is getting complex. Oh, this is this has been complex this entire time, and it only gets more so as we go. But this is big. This is huge. What do these do then? I mean, it looks very cool, but why though? <laughs> what? What? Oh wait, can you just like put them all in? Oh my god. Oh, except for this one. Because this is the eye and they can't find it. Okay. How does he put them all? Okay. Sorry. Um. Yep, that, um, hmm? Mm hmm Doesn't look quite, doesn't, mm, nope. Doesn't look quite right. We broke it. We broke it. <sighs> okay. I think we, we got it. I think we actually got everything, though. Here. I don't think I missed it. Okay, well, right on time, too. But I don't think we missed anything.
Hmm. Hmm. So they think that the eye has the same properties as the quantum moon, but it's around the sun. And they built a gravity cannon on the orbit of Giant's Deep. To shoot at it. To shoot a probe to it. Well, there's my ship in outer space, because the place where it was sitting collapsed. Hmm. Interesting. I mean, in theory, we could go straight to the... To the cannon. I mean, probably... I'm actually gonna do that anyway. I'm gonna go check out the cannon because I'm, pre I'm pretty sure that they're talking about the cannon that we see exploding in the beginning of every cycle. I'm pretty sure we're like when we start, we're looking at giants deep in the sky and we can see the explosion. But I mean, I... Mm... I don't know if it would be helpful to us to, like, see it. Especially because it's broken, right? Look, there it is. Yeah, it fired. And now it's just broken. Alright, I lost track of where the thing it shot ended up in. I, I, need, to, I need to look at the, um... At the logs to like recap everything. This game is pretty. I, this game is fucking amazing, dude. I swear. This is so fucking wild. So fucking wild. Like, <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't mean to make that into a pun because of the name of the game, but like, you know, right? This. The Nomide aesthetic is right, okay, we know that. The new, more sensitive locator in the Nomai built was unable to detect any trace of the eye's signal. Based on their knowledge of the quantum moon, the Nomai believed the eye was in a distant orbit around the in a distant orbit around the sun. In a distant orbit. So not even necessarily close to it. The Namaya decided to stop searching for the high signal and instead look for it visually by sending out a deep space probe. There were concerns that the probability of launching a probe in the correct direction would be absurdly small. No cy- okay, right, the cyclones, right. So what do we get from this? Also, wait, what the fuck were they doing in the forge? Black will spend the hanging city. I found those footage of the model where this is the reason the Lord of the Forge. The Black Hole Forge district is the highest district of the hanging city. The my name Pope planned to create a new advanced warp core. Warp core? Why were they getting a warp core? I forgot. Did they want to reconstruct this? Okay, they did. Right, they did. They did. Right. Huh. That doesn't seem relevant, though. I'm gonna start seeing a lot of my spot for Count Grimmery. Godspeed, Grim. Good luck. Leveling is rough. I hope it goes easy on you. Ah. <sighs>
now we actually have more reason to come to like f try to get inside this tower but how should eat breakfast you should eat breakfast Tom what the fuck it's the most important meal of the day I get to the placements as well I like it. Pla placements I like doing placements are exciting leveling not so much I say this, but I never leveled. I mean, I only have one account, but from seeing other people doing it, it seems like <gasps> pain. <sighs> we have more reasons now to get inside the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. But how? What's up, PK Grim? Oh, whoa. God damn it. I mean, we didn't quite finish trying. That whole like jumping from close from like mm, okay, that's right. Let's just go again. Let's go again. Let's just go again. I always forget the fucking controls for this. Jesus Christ. Ay ay ay. Okay. All right. All right. Imagine we spend as long as we're spending in Brittle Hollow in every other planet. That would be fucking wild. That would be fucking wild. the right way I am there's the gravity cannon where is the tower oh shit it's pushing the wrong fucking button I am not a smart person. I am smart enough to do this now, though, instead of just... Oh, wait, actually, hold on, let me... Just, 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 just in case. Just in case, you know? Just in case. Let's see if the door stayed unlocked, you know? Just in case. That would be exciting. That would be very exciting. Fuck. But I mean, yeah, of course, of course it would. Why, why would it? Why would it stay unlocked? You know, wouldn't make any sense. It wouldn't make any sense. <sighs> Uh, tower, 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 tower. Uh... Where the fuck was it? Oh! Here we go. Here we go. Bonk. Uh... Wait, hello? Where am I? <laughs> I'm right on top of it. Very cool. This is fine, right? Yeah, sure. Structural integrity? Never heard of her. <laughs> Hell yeah. Alright. Hello. Wait. Actually... 
What did this sound like again? Wait, why can't I? Didn't this used to make a sound? All right, okay, cool. Oh wait, frequency. Right? Quantum fluctuations. Right. Right, right, right. I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid sometimes, I swear. Distress beacon. Interesting. I forgot that I forget to check through these sometimes. It's uh not very uh not very scientific of me. Okay, let's see. Ideally, I would be able to like do this. Exactly. Fuck. <sighs> Did this from like another angle? Okay. It's it's. Mm. God damn it. <sighs> There's no way you can make this. There's no way. I would like need to fucking shimmy my way through one of these gaps and then like land on the wall there. Ah, yeah, yeah. I need like fucking three jetpacks to make that. God damn it. Bruh, no fucking shot. Man. Man. <laughs> this sucks. Ah. Uh, this is legitimately like the most frustrating part of the game. Fucking hell. Why this thing had to break? Hmm. What else could we do? Imagine if you got the ship down here. Wouldn't that be interesting? But you can't fit it through these fucking spaces. That wouldn't work. I'm at a loss, dude. I don't know. I'm at a loss here. It's extra frustrating now that I know that I have an extra reason to get there. <laughs> Let me break this. Please. If only the scout could like do other shit, you know? Like, let the fucking scout teleport me.
Oh wait, that's me. Hi. <laughs> I didn't notice this before. Can we? Okay. Interesting. Wouldn't it be something? Wouldn't it be something? <gasps> oh. Wouldn't it be something? What if? What if? What if there's a gap there somewhere? That you can get to. That would be so smart, actually. Especially if, like... If you use the scout to find that gap in the wall. Fuck's sake. I can actually just trash, let's go! Hi Zoltor. How you doing today, buddy? I'm too lazy. I'm too lazy to look around with, with the scout. I, I, I just, I just... I just wanna, I just wanna look. I just wanna, f I just wanna... <laughs> can you do <clears throat> are you dying repeatedly but I'm I, I I think actually I think you'd really like this game maybe you know I think you might actually really enjoy this I don't know why but like I, I get I get this I get this feeling I get this feeling that you would enjoy it. Where is it even going? Huh. <laughs> Just a little burn. You know? No biggie. Um, but yeah, I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Glad to hear you're doing good as well. Wait, is that it? It looks like it. Where's it going? What's the probe doing though? Wait, I... Hey yo, can we ping this? <laughs> can we... <laughs> Can we put a marker on this guy? Cause I'm gonna lose track of it if I get on the ship. Is it that thing? Fuck. Nah, I lost it. God damn it. Fuck. <laughs> or maybe it found its destination. Oh, well, whatever. I got work to do. Hi, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go again. Here we go again. F it, it is it is it is not a complete F. It's, uh... It's, um... Found its destination. The sun... 
it might be looking for something that is orbiting the sun. Right? Here's what's happening. The hypothesis that these guys were working with was that the eye of the universe has the same properties as the quantum moon that is orbiting uh, this planet. And so they decided to build a gravity cannon on the orbit of a different planet, which is giant deep. And they wanted to shoot a probe from that gravity cannon to try and find it. Because using the probe shit technology that they were using was literally not working, even after they built a more advanced um, observatory. So now, I'm trying once again to get inside of this fucking building. My guy really said, fuck it, let's turn the planet into a cannon to find it. No, 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 no. They, they, didn't, they didn't turn the planet into the cannon. They just built the cannon on its orbit. In fact, the thing that you see when you start the, the cycle... Um, sure, fuck it. We'll just leave it like this. Yeah, that's fine. Why do I worry? Um, okay. Uh, the thing that we see exploding on the beginning of each cycle, I think, is that gravity cannon that they built. Which... Uh, is, like, destroyed in the process of launch, I guess? Which is kind of weird, but, you know. Who am I to question technology from extinct alien species? Man. Can I crouch? Please let me in. Please let me in. I'm crying. Why is my ship moving so fast? Did it fall? That'd be kind of funny. There isn't- there doesn't seem to be any... Cracks here. That's what I was hoping for, right? Cuz- Okay, dude. Okay, dude. That wasn't that hard, man. Relax. Um... So I, like, shimmied my way around there. I could find a fucking entrance there's no way in there's no way in wait can i ask the guy actually maybe he knows i didn't think about this before but what if he talked to the guy like yo you, do you know how to get into the observatory or the uh, tower of fucking quantum knowledge it's like oh yeah sure here it is they wouldn't do that right Right. <laughs> right. Hey, man. Uh, I'm in a hurry. Can I ask you something? Sure, of course. Anything you want. Um. Oh, we can tell him stuff, I guess. Hello, Mr. Idle D. 
Uh, I saw the hanging city on Brittle Hollow. You visited the hanging? Oh, how was it? Beautiful? Was it scary? Hanging city is where the Lomai settled permanently on Brittle Hollow. It's the most advanced settlement here. Just the builder. Most advanced settlements are close to the, you know, what is beyond me. But the kind of thing that makes sense to Lomai, though. They did need the black hole for something. It was the forge. Um... Hmm. Okay, it doesn't they don't know, dude. <laughs> Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. How y'all doing today? I'm doing great. I'm getting a little bit frustrated, though. But I'm having fun. I'm still really enjoying this game. The fact it's frustrating just just helps me. Or. Um, to me, it says, it speaks to how interesting the game is. Because if I didn't care about it, I wouldn't get as frustrated about having a hard time fucking figuring this shit out. But because I'm actually like really invested in it, like I want to find out. I'm so sorry, that is an unfortunate kink. Uh, send these stairs, man. Fuck you. Fuck you. Send these stairs. Man. <laughs> I want that. <laughs> hey, you want to trade kinks? <laughs> man. Um, I really don't know. I really don't know what to do here. Jesus Christ. I offer you a kink trade. Hmm. How intriguing. Why the fuck would they build this with only that one entrance anyway? Scuff that architecture, man. What if I'm stupid? What if there is a different entrance? Definitely fire code violation. Yeah, I mean, honestly, if you think about it, w w you know, I... <sighs> this, between the, the, between the fucking meteorite sun and the structural integrity going on, I think fire code violations would be like the least of their concerns. But still, though, <laughs> I wish it were a more relevant concern to them. Because maybe then they'd have built another fucking entrance. God damn it. Probably full of asbestos. I know what that is. Wait, I know what that is. This is the shit in the walls, right? That they have in America for, like, insulation, right? I think. Also, hi, blind tourist. Welcome. Yeah, right, which is not for eating. And it's like toxic, right? I remember hearing a bit about it. But I don't think 
Do we have that? Home? I don't think we have that. In my country. But then again, I'm not really a big, um... House knower. So... Shouldn't breathe it, considering it's a rock. Can you turn it into a powder and inhale it, though? Is that a possibility? I haven't looked around here. I mean, not, not that it's gonna help, right? Because... <clears throat> okay. okay. This is fine. This is fine. We're fine. We're good. We're go oh my god, okay. Isn't that stuff they made those cheap roof like things? I think it went on walls. Not a roof, but again, not an expert. I shouldn't really be uh throwing out guesses. All things considered. Um I'm developing like a profound hatred for this building. I ha I have to to be honest here. Man. Where am I? What? Oh, okay. Got it. <clears throat> I guess it's to pop, but looking at it wrong, it breaks into microscopic fibers that are like razor blades in your lungs. Okay. All right. So, inhaling, probably not a good uh, idea. Got it. Got it. Understood. <laughs> Let it rip. Fucking hell. Please, man. But it doesn't catch fire? True, true, you make a good point. If you inhale it and you can withstand the, 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 the funny, the funny lung, oh, fuck me. Well, there goes that. Um, if you can withstand the funny lung tickles, you become fireproof. I think that might be a good trade. You ever wanted to walk on the sun? Here's how. Life hacks. If you inhale asbestos, you can walk the surface of the sun. Incredible. My vitals look so bad. I feel like if I if I like stub my toe, I'm gonna die. <laughs> it's okay. I, I I lived I lived a good I lived a good thirty minutes. So the next and I'm sure the next thirty will be even better. Comedy films from Silent Film Era where they made suits from his. Oh my God, really? It's kind of morbid. <laughs> Ah, uh, trade offer. You receive fire resistance. I receive your lungs. To be honest, if you're if you're intending on walking through fire, you're probably not going to be doing a whole lot of breathing anyway. Get okay, that ends there also. Stupid fucking shit closed building. Where's the club weapon? Or the club item that I can use as a weapon to break these windows? Wait. Wait. What? Wait. What? Wait. 
Structural integrity one. Doesn't that wait? Wait. So what What if we're just here when this breaks and falls into the hole? What then? What's going to happen? Horrible time for me to find out because I'm at half oxygen and fuel. Oh my Physical integrity is uh, not 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 looking not looking too hot, but you know what? There is no time like the present. This is a very strong one percent, I have to say. Pause, champ. Pause, champ. Huh? Is it... If only I could- wait, hold on. This is valid, isn't it? Assuming that the tower is intact in here? It's in space now. So I can... I... It's all here. It's all here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Tell me there's worse than this! <laughs> also, hi. Runon. Overthought. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I hate how much sense it makes. It's so fucking stupid. <laughs> Just if there's no gravity. There's no problem, you know? 
Just let the fucking tower fall into the black hole. It's gonna be in space. There's no gravity. There's no gap in the wall. You're in? It's that simple. Just float. Just float. I have fucking... Look at my fuel. I... Anyone got an oxygen, uh, like a, a, a fuel tank here or something? That would be, that would be so poggers. That would be incredible, actually. Maybe, maybe, maybe one of my buddies like tossed one down here or something, you know? Not asking for much. Just, just a little tank. That's all. That's all. We made it though, you know? We we made it. I'm gonna die, but we made it. Now we know how how it's done. <sighs> I'm gonna actually fucking lose my mind. Fuel level critical. Thanks, man. Thanks. God. Uh, uh. Please. <gasps> Too close, man. Wear glasses. Shit. If you're here to make your first pilgrimage to the quantum moon, you're almost prepared to set out on your deeply significant journey. Before you do, pause and remember your history. I don't want to remember my history. I don't want to remember how fucking long it took me to get inside of this piece of shit tower. <clears throat> we make this journey not only for ourselves, but also to honor the members of our clan who came before us. Those who after the crash that brought them to the star system, became stranded on Brittle Hollow and Amber Twin, with no communication between those two groups of survivors. Is Namai looked up look upward from two different planets and saw the same wandering moon visiting their skies. It was this moon, the quantum moon, that kept their curiosity alive during this long period of hardship. Please. Please. I'm wasting time reading this fucking eulogy after the two after the two divide i okay you know what maybe i don't need to read this you know maybe you know it up the it updated my ship log um i'm gonna get back here in a second once i why is that spinning fuck's sake no no, no, please, please tell me what I need to know. Ah, no, please. Maybe if I scan them all very quickly. Okay, okay, this is good. The ship log updated. Excellent, fantastic. Welcome, Solani. Your arrival here means you completed your preparations for the giant sleep and ready to depart from the quantum moon. On your pilgrimage, the quantum moon will carry you just to carry me and a many of our clan before me to the moon's sixth and most secret location. You'll be ending your pilgrimage to the shrine to remember the final rule. To explore the sixth location, the shrine must be on the moon's north pole. Beca is that. Wait, is the, the, the shrine must be on the moon's north pole. The shrine must be on the what? Man, I'm glad they put that shit in the fucking log because I'm so disoriented. Like, I'm actually tilted in my seat. I don't know if you guys can tell it from my... Just from how I'm sitting, but I'm like getting like all twisted and shit. Can we look? Can we look at it? 
can kind of look at it. Alright, I guess the building just disappeared. No, but I do! Soltor, listen! Listen! I do, okay? I'm struggling with this shit, but it's because I'm stupid, okay? And, it, like, the, I'm st I'm enjoying the, 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 the <laughs> I'm enjoying, I'm enjoying it, you know? I'm just incredibly stupid, all right? I'm just very, very stupid. Hold on. Did that go in a different direction this time? It looked like it. I don't know if Santa is going up or down or not moving. <laughs> what sanity? It does look really cool. It's so cool. Like, this is... There, I, I can't, I can't do it justice if I talk to people about this game. I can't do it justice. What the fuck? Okay. The Namai built a shrine on the quantum moon to aid in the pilgrimage to its sixth location. Built a shrine that a qu okay. The pilgrims to the quantum moon is a deeply significant journey for the Namai. After the two groups of the Namai stranded on Ember Twin and Brittle Hall were united, it became their united goal to find and visit the quantum moon. Many Namai went on a pilgrimage during which the quantum moon carried them to its sixth and most secret location. Okay, this is good. This is valuable information because now we know what to look for when we're on the moon. However, please don't tell me I missed something. I thought that the tower would tell you how the fuck you're supposed to operate the... Um, the shuttle cannon, right? Because you can go to the gravity cannon right now, you can use the shuttle, you can fire it and everything... But I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing with it. Like... Our problem was that it... Yes, it fires the shuttle. But fuck knows where it's gonna end up in. You know? It doesn't, like... It... It doesn't land on the moon, right? Not by itself. I think... Wait. I think it's time we pay another visit to the gravity cannon. You know? 
I gotta go, but have, work. have fun. Thank you. I I am having a lot of fun, unironically. I'm actually having so much fucking fun. And good luck at work, Salter. Thank you for stopping by and hanging out. I appreciate you. Okay, that's scary. I don't remember saying that. I mean, I'm sure it's true, but that's also very scary. Worms! Good game. Good game. Not a good kink, but you know, good game. Please reroll. You can. Testing. See? See? It knows. It knows. Okay. Oh, 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 oh my goodness. Wow. That was going to take me longer. <clears throat> Here we go again. Perhaps I have parked this uh, in a suboptimal location. Ow. It's over here. Maybe, maybe, maybe there's shit here that I didn't read. That would help me out in figuring this out. Um, huh? Why? What for? Oh, oh, wait, hold on. I don't remember this. Do I remember this? Have I seen this? Hold on. I don't think I have. I don't think I have. I don't think I've seen this. What the fuck is this? Wait, yeah, I have. Never mind, I'm stupid. I have seen this. Just to make sure, though. Right? Right. 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 Cool. I wish I had, like, a memory. That would be so helpful. Especially in situations like these when you have to, like, remember things. So helpful. Why did I do this? Like, actually, why did I do that? Why am I like this? Just, you know, like... Why? I, I, you know what? It's because it's because I I hadn't been here in like a couple a couple of cycles, perhaps a couple. I think a couple, maybe. Clearly, I missed I I missed the the fucking black hole. So I just had to pay it a visit again. Perfectly reasonable, in my opinion. Perfectly reasonable. Ay, 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 ay. Just use stairs, man. Just use stairs. Do not be afraid of stairs. I know being like a homestuck reader and all, stairs get a like, you know. A bit of a a bit of a um, Pavlovian response, but uh, stairs are good. Stairs are good for you. <sighs> Pain. Pain. Okay. All right, we're back on track. Maybe I shouldn't waste my fuel getting there, but. Fuck it, am I right? Am I right, gamers? Boop.
thought that was gonna hurt. Whoop! Whoop! Okay, 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 okay. Whoop! Whoop! Okay. All right. Aw, it's cute. Little benches. That's nice. Okay, all right stairs see see isn't that much more reasonable Than fucking trying to jump down like a oh, wait hold on Can I okay, okay. Well, I guess I do have to jump down uh, Unfortunate Unfortunate it's okay uh, Okay, okay Okay, that's fine. That's fine. All right. Here we are again. Um, we gotta call it back. We gotta call it back. So there's the switch to telep to. There's the right, right, right. It's the fucking sh the horseshoe bullshit. The shuttle is currently resting at the quantum moon. Is it now? Interesting. Okay. Wait. What if we just launch it? That's what happens. It just goes off into fucking god knows where. It's off in space somewhere. So we call it back. Okay. Now we do the same thing, but inside of it. Was there like... Something that I misread? Maybe I missed in in the in the tower. Actually, no, no, no. wait, why are there three positions? Okay, right, one is recall. Wait, yeah, why, why are there three positions? One is launch, one is recall, what's the other one? What does this one do? Doesn't seem like it does anything. How? How? That's right, I'm so stupid. Wait, this locates the moon, doesn't it? This frequency... 
locates the moon. I, now that I think about it, this is probably the landing switch. So wait. Wait, no, that's two. Hmm. What I'm thinking is, maybe I just need to, like, fuck around with the frequency enough. For it to line up. Wait. Oh my god, wait. Wait. Why am I going to the sun? have to snipe the moon yeah wait I'm going into the Sun do I just I mean I didn't trust it I didn't trust it I didn't trust it I did not trust it I was kind of thinking like, hmm, you know, maybe I just, if I just let it go, maybe I just let it run its course, maybe I'll end up there, but it died. I don't know. I don't know. That didn't seem like it's gonna, it was gonna work out very well. You know what I mean? moving away three sixty no scope of the moon honestly that would kind of be valid not gonna lie that would kind of be valid Oh. Wait, what did that do? Oh! Oh, Jesus Christ. We're, we're landing in the fucking giant's deep. Fuck. No, thank you. Holy hell. We landed somewhere with this thing. Holy shit. Wait. Actually kind of huge. Why am I looking at the... fell apart we spent so long here that the gravity cannon fell apart wait why is there like a billion fucking different fluctuations now does this thing even still work yeah I didn't think so I didn't think so. How the fuck do we do that? Hmm. 
my only guess. <gasps> my only guess. Is that we need to somehow line up the launcher with the with the moon. Right? Wait. Oh, right, the unknown because it's the, the fucking test thing that they have here, right? Hold on. Just to make perfectly sure. I think I'm right about this, but... I want to be sure. Snipe the moon! I mean, we're gonna have to try. Yeah, these are like the test fucking shard things over here. But I think I'll like... I just wanna make... Yeah, there we go. Museum shard. Museum shard. Museum shard. Oh, maybe that's why you started picking up so many signals just then. Cause it was like fucking um uh how you say the quantum shit was going haywire right so that was its um inability to locate it correctly there's too many quantum signals what is that one though? That one looks close. This this looks like it's on planets. What the fuck? You know I never I never actually walked around here with the suit and everything. What if I did? You know? What if I did? All this talk about space travel and shit, and we're just being cringe and doing the same thing as we are doing on Earth. Where we start exploring the fucking... ...space before we completely explore the planet. I've literally never walked here. On the surface of my own planet. Disgraceful. What the fuck? Come on, dude. That is nothing. Oh. There's a grove? There's a shard here? Why? Crossal bark, the quiet shade. It's always dark in the ancient glade. Scary. Hi, Dwagon. How you doing? Yeah, my knees have, you know, they've, they've seen better days, but it's okay. You know, we'll just, we'll just patch up, as we always do. It's fine. It's fine. No biggie. Mad out to play Payday 2. Good luck. Have fun. And thank you for stopping by. Church research notes. Probably a church. A detective sent a strange signal coming from somewhere within the Grovenous crater. It's very signal to the 
emitted by the quantum moons. The same reason the two signals are probably related. We don't know much about the quantum moon, seeing as no one's ever been able to land on it, but hopefully studying the signal in the grove will reveal more about it. Okay. Is that all there is to it, maybe? They just found the quantum shard here? Hmm. Get that pay on this day. Today. On this day. We pay for our sins. But yeah, how's it going? Wait, Dragon, you were trying to do, you were trying to do like a placements thing, right? Or you were trying to get, fuck, hold on. Brain worky. Uh, you were trying to get something placed, an account placed before the season ended. How did that go? Oh. Wait, I'm stupid. And three two, so not bad. Nice, nice. Bonk. Quantum Grove. Okay, that was one of the signals that they picked up. Gotcha. Gotcha. <sighs> the twins. Giants deep. I found a poem written on one of the trees in the grove. Hmm. A couple seasons ago, I climbed to be like 33720. So last season, I went for one and place. We did 50XR. Then I went 3 2 in this place. We got like 20 ish. Almost. As Cool functional system, Blizzard. Very, very cool. Thank you, Aaron. Incredible work. Uh, wait, hold on, there's something else there. Right, okay, that's not helpful. Um, maybe we try to snipe the moon again? I have my suit on. I do. It's like, it's basically the only thing we can do. I guess... Wait, actually... Let me have a look here. What are those? Aha. Uh -huh. Get it? Because it's water. Very funny. Right, that's the grove that we went to just now. Quantum shards in there. Uh, I think that's it. Small world. Um, wouldn't it be interesting if Oh, but I don't need that. I just realized I'm stupid. I was gonna say, wouldn't it be interesting if we uh, shot a uh, scout to the quantum moon? If we, well, if, <laughs> if we saw it, and that would help us locate it and operate the gravity cannon. But we can just do that with the fucking scanner. Um. Where is, uh, where is Middle Hollow? <laughs> Hello? What the fuck? I have an Overwatch boot camp starting up next. You can really learn some cool stuff. Wow. Damn. They make those? It sounds exciting. Um, am I on crack? Whoa, shit. Okay, alright. I guess it was just very far. It's the only one I've heard of that isn't restricted to... Wait, why would they make... Why would they make an educational thing? 
and make it restricted to top pros. Like that sounds that seems kind of counterintuitive. It's like the I feel like those would be the people that need it the less. Will there be over drill sergeants yelling at you? <laughs> that would be very that would be very authentic. Bootcamps are really good for getting up to speed very quickly on specific things. I see. So I guess if pro, if like high-level players hadn't played in a while or something, these pro teams do bootcamps pre-season. Interesting. That makes sense. Yeah. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Why am I going so slowly? Or is it just very far away? Oh. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Oh, there it is. Hello. Hello. Please let me land. Thank you. Um, okay. Okay. What? Oh, perfect landing. Easy. Love to see it. Okay, here we go again. Why? Why? Why do I, like, just refuse to learn? God damn it. Ay, 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 ay. Man, it sucks that you know that it's in the right place and you have to like pull it back. Fucking hell. Okay, we try again. Bosses have on bookends and merge a lot of team specific with play style specific sessions. Maybe as a way to get teams to synergize very good before seasons. Right, right, right. That makes sense. Right, so that's not what we're looking for. We're looking for that. Stay there. Wait, fuck. Fuck! That's the one on the. T ah, god damn it. That's the one on the twins. I don't pick up it. I mm. know me as a guest coach as well. I I remember him. I think I remember. I remember seeing his Twitch. I was following him for some reason on Twitch, and I remember like recently I saw him like play like FIFA or something. Oh, 
This sucks, man. It's giant steep. That's fucking. Uh... <laughs> so we don't actually pick up the fucking frequency of the moon. How do I? I'm lost then. I'm lost then. I don't know what to do. How do we... I don't know. On the hint? Not a hint, but I will ask if, did I miss something in the fucking, uh, in the Tower of Quantum Knowledge? Was it there? And I fucking missed it because I was in the in the fucking in a rush. There's another thing that said the pull some pull out of face north or something. Um, that has to do with the, already the moon itself. I think. I think. Wait, right? It said that the sanctuary had to be on the north pole for the moon to go to its... Isn't the ship boxes? Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. It does say, okay, okay, cool. That's it then. Fuck. That's it. Ah, goddamn it. You wanted to do a scientific method. <laughs> Don't know what that means. <laughs> Ah, I'm out of ideas, man. I'm just gonna, you know, maybe we do 360. With signals? Yeah, but... The, the signals we're picking up are all on the... Um, wait. Are they? We know those. Tower shard. Oh, oh, on... Wait. Wait, are we already... No, we're not. Okay. <laughs> Fucking hell. Um... Wait, I forgot what the fuck the tower shard is. Not in the tower of knowledge. You got what you needed there. God fucking damn it. Man. Wait, maybe my idea for to put a scout on the moon wasn't that stupid after all. Because I was assuming you could pick up the signal of the moon, but I completely forgot. But, uh, I mean, it doesn't seem like you can. This is Giants Deep, and then the other one is the fucking the twins, I think. The other unknown we're picking up, I think is the twins, yeah. So maybe I do, I do try and, I do try to plant the scouts on it. It's so annoying, I've literally been there too. And I, like... <laughs> I flew to it with my ship. I 
think. I'm pretty sure. Unless I'm misremembering, but I'm pretty sure I flew to it. <sighs> Man. I'm almost sure I flew to it once. So if I could find it again. I could try to plant that scout there. I don't know why I'm walking back. I think this is this is a That's a GG for this cycle. <laughs> if only there was an option to teleport to the shuttle instead of teleporting the shuttle back. If there was an option to teleport to the shuttle right at the beginning. That's so annoying. It literally tells you, "Hey, the shuttle's in in the Moon. Right. Yeah. <sighs> Fucking hell. Oh my god, the quantum moon is coming from inside the house! <laughs> so you've been to the one in Giant Steep then? No. I haven't. I've literally... <laughs> I've spent so long in this fucking game, and the only planet I've been to is this one. Oh, and the bramble, the the the, the, the fucking t oh my fucking god, it it I don't care, I don't care. This cycle is over. Um, yeah, I've only really been exploring uh fucking Brittle Hollow. I went to the 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 the, the, the root planet that I forgot the name of. And I got eaten by the fish. And I know that there's like something on the Ember Twins, like a fossil or something, that's gonna give us the intel on how to escape the fish, perhaps, hopefully. Whoa, God, okay, J Tony Hawk, please, please relax. Please relax, oh. I'm so glad I don't have motion sickness. <laughs> it won't stop, please. Oh my god, please stop. This is pain. This is pain. I can't even fucking flip the the <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not doing okay, dude. I'm so glad at least we know that this shit's gonna. F okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. I without even without even realizing. Please, please, let me in. 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 Ah. Ah. Please. Let me down, let me down. Oh my god, I hated that. Uh, not a big hint, but kind of obvious that all planets are hints. Interconnect, yes, of course, of course. Yeah, yeah, I've noticed that they keep they keep uh, enforcing that idea. Especially with like the whole, um... The, the fucking Zoom call platforms are really helpful to establish that. The way that they actually just give you like a little preview of the, the spaces. That you're going to next. That's really helpful. I like that a lot. Um, but yeah, it very clearly it seems like it's not going to be like a one, a one-stop shop type beat. Ah. <sighs> Oh, so you're telling me that I'm supposed to right now instead of just trying to fucking brute force this like a dumbass. I could use a change of scenery to be completely honest with you. I've been doing nothing but visiting this fucking planet for like... <laughs> Since the beginning, I went to the moon 
I went to the fucking root planet, and then as soon as I set foot on Brittle Hollow, I just kept going there. Over and over again. I've been to everything there, I think. <sighs> God damn it. Okay, um... What time is it? It's eight, dude. Maybe I, maybe I should have, you know, been a bit more, um... Been a bit more quick to change course with things. Maybe the point was to side... to get sidetracked all the time. The one time I sp I go into the I I start up the game with the intent of like sticking to one objective, I found out I find out I'm not fucking supposed to. Hell yeah! Ah, <laughs> oh, god damn it! All right, all right, all right, all right. So... <clears throat> I, could go, I mean, I have to go to both of them then. Just to... What if something happens if you, cat if you catalog both of the signals of the shards on the planets, right? If we check these out... You know? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, actually, we, did, we didn't completely finish checking this stuff out. But you know what? I won't. I won't now. I won't now. Ah, oh, god damn it. <sighs> this looks so small here, but in my head, this shit already looks like the fucking, um... Like the like the Charlie Day meme, you know. It's it's already getting there inside my head. Okay, where do we go now? Or did what else were they doing on Giant Steep? They had the orbital cannon. There's the signal as well. They had the orbital cannon. You didn't develop it, did you? <laughs> Honestly, I kind of... <laughs> I was kind of like more all over the place when I started playing. Um... I need to return to my roots then. You know? Say fuck it. Say fuck it. Ah, uh, it's water. It's going to going to water planet. Let's go. I mean, just do a little drive by by the gravity cannon. Have a little peek at it. I think I did before, already, but. What the gap? What the who the fuck? Shit, I don't remember anyone's name. Is that- is that- is that the one by the campfire? At the beginning? I can talk to them next cycle. I say next cycle, cycle because you know, that's easier than making my way back. <laughs> and you know you're gonna end up there again, anyway. Hey, who is Gabriel? 
I think I'm almost sure it's the fire camp. Ca camp. Campfire. Person. Too fast. Too fast. Uh... I hate having to like regulate my speed like this. It's very, uh, very frustrating. Autopilot is not so bad unless this. <laughs> yeah. So true. You know what's funny? I don't, I don't know if that's like the typical thing, but I haven't landed on the um, on the big sun, but autopilot has made me land on the little fucking sun on um, Brill Hollow. That was very funny. Dude, this shit is zooming. This this fucking thing, this debris moves faster than me. Swear to God. I don't know why I'm trying to, like, get near it. It's just going to the planet, you know? This looks like a suspiciously flat surface. Do we just, like, breach the surface and it's, like, water in there now? How does it work? Let's find out. Ooh. Wait. Oh, I'm still locking onto this thing. Oops. They're all by campfires. That's a no. I'm okay. I mean the the the, the one at the start. That campfire. The campfire. Are they actually all by campfires? I've only. Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus! Holy shit! What the fuck? God damn! Oh, <laughs> oh shit! Wait, let me look around this. What? Can my ship go fucking underwater? I, f I, I feel like that wouldn't make a lot of sense, but... Oh! Landing pad? Question mark? Oh my goodness! Wow! He so here they have fucking landing pad technology and everything. Sick. This is incredible. What the fuck? Ship is made of plywood is capable of speed. <laughs> you know what? That's a good point. That's a good point. I don't think we're working with a with a. Why are you telling me to? G I get the feeling that maybe I should have been here sooner to, for this to be <laughs> for the game to be telling me this now. say statue workshop oh no someone wasn't very happy with their product god damn <laughs> fucking nine hours into the game so here's the tutorial planet by the way 
Uh <laughs> they have, they have fucking like <laughs> Introducing you to the fucking gravity rocks on the wall. Oh my god. Unlucky. Unlucky. This looks so fucking cool though, holy shit. You just like look at this Uh what? Okay, I remember they did mention that these things like shoot you with some of the fucking things shoot you into orbit. Are we Wait. So they have like a little safety zone. Because this thing keeps fucking shooting into orbit and then being pulled back? What? You're going to test the memory statues tonight. Flock says it could be dangerous, so we can come. But, what if they didn't use the door and snuck in the other way? Does anyone want to? I really want to see the test too, Lemmy. But there's a huge risk to take. We probably shouldn't. Maybe Flox will let us see at a later test. Flox specifically told us not to do that. Fucking nerds. Safety first. Uh, yeah? No kidding? You have fucking structures that go off into space. You better fucking have safety somewhere. Wait, so how could- how do you know? How do you know that it's coming? Wait. I don't remember if I took my meds this morning. Oh dear. That's, that's... That's not good. Oh, fuck, I was hoping that maybe like that thing would lift. When the thing was close to happening, but... That didn't seem like it. I'm so fucking... Unsure now. I feel like I'm not safe to walk around. Because at any point it'll just... Do the thing again. Okay, how do I get under here? Hmm... I'm assuming if we see like a big fucking tornado. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I've seen this before. Is there like. Is there another station? You're welcome to Giant's Deep, friends. I'm excited to meet. for you to meet the statues. I'm not a dwelling, I'm like in my workshop below, inside the island. Huh. Inside the island. Hmm. Um. Oh, okay, wait, I'm going the wrong way. 
Uh, 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 <laughs> that's getting too close. I think we're good. All right. So I guess we have to figure out how to get inside. Hmm. Oh, well, oh, wait a minute. Did I come from here? I think I might have. There's no <laughs> wrong way. <laughs> All paths will lead to somewhere. Kind of confused now, though, Wade. What's this? So that's how you tell. That's so fucking cool, dude. What? That is so fucking cool. <laughs> Holy shit. Um Okay. These guys mentioned a different way. Right? Like, like there's this there's another path here. We may be able to find it from the inside. If only I was good at like making sense of these fucking candids. I'm so my sense of direction and like orient. Wait, what is that over there? I see something on the ceiling. Where? This way somewhere? Huh. That's where you're standing? Wait, is it? No, like, be be beyond the... Um, like, I can see the grid. The little... The, 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 the fucking... This shit. On the ceiling. But, like, a little bit beyond that, there's, like, a tiny little light there, you know? Like, uh, fuck, can you, wait, can you see the mouse when I do this? You can, yeah. Like, here, you know? This, this is where I'm standing, right? I think. Like, the grid. And I'm like, I'm seeing this tiny little light over there. That's kind of what I'm on the lookout for, because I keep thinking that these could be the funny uh, gravity rocks. But it does seem like a bit of a far-fetched place for it to be in. Fuck me, dude. I'm too stupid to figure this out. I might as well. I might as well just look around here. Uh. 
has a bit more this planet has like higher gravity doesn't it i haven't been looking at the number very often but it does say times two This would be too obvious, right? I'm, I'm pretty- yeah, this is where I came from. This is where I came from. I remember. Maybe. Maybe I remember. Jesus Christ, you literally- oh god. Oh dear. Oh dear. Huh? Okay. I, 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 I guess you don't drown. That's cool. Wait, is that also a black hole? Do all the fucking planets in the system have like a black hole at the bottom? It's kind of weird. I guess this makes more sense for like trying to. F oh. Well, okay, well. Sure, sure, that's pretty straightforward. Silly of me to think that, you know, like the jetpack wouldn't work underwater. My mistake, my mistake, honestly, my bad. Where does that one take you? It seems like difficult to even get to it because you keep getting pushed to the surface. Okay, we have another one of these. We have another one of these charts, like the one that was in... <laughs> this literally is a fucking tutorial island. God damn it. Yeah, would you kindly step back so Daz is closer to the statue when pairing? The statue will choose... They... L You're joking. The statue will choose whoever is in closest proximity. See how his eyes have opened? That tells us the statue is paired with Daz. Now, no matter where he is in the star system, Daz's statue will record his memories and send them to the Ash Twin Project. This is extraordinary sculpting work, Phlox. He has not done himself again, hasn't he? And now that we have our first successful pairing, we can test my memory storage prototype. Each statue will send a single demise memories to his or her own storage unit within the Ash Twin. Each statue, each storage unit will be equipped with a mask, the, the statue's counterpart, which will be able to send these stored memories back to the corresponding Nomai. Why did I end up on Brittle Hollow first? You know... <sighs> Welcome back, Shinny. I see we're still going. Yep. I am a thirsty for knowledge, dude. <sighs> Turns out, um, uh, I may have perhaps gone to not the ideal first location first. That's it, right? I 
sounds pretty close. There we go. Okay. Um. Have we done a single meme stream this week, or are we gonna be like 40 years? We we have not done a single one because typically, like the streams this week, I've been going over long, oh, like over time for so long that by the time I'm done, uh, there's no one here. Um, so it, it, it feels like I shouldn't do them. So yeah, we are 40, 40 years behind. I've installed the Mass Society the Ashton project, Flocks. They look beautiful. Although, I do feel as though I'm being observed. It's comforting to know the statues will not pair until the project succeeds. Otherwise, I imagine the experience would be hard to endure. Ideally, they'll only need to activate once the project succeeds. As a safety measure, however, the statues will also activate in the event of equipment failure. They will? Why is that? If anything goes wrong with the Ash Twin project, the statues and their mass will make us aware of the situation and enable us to fix it. Otherwise, it would be possible for us to remain permanently unaware of the problem. I hadn't thought of that. What a profoundly horrific fate that would be. Wait. What? I'm not quite getting this part. Fucking masks, pa pairing. Pairing is when one, uh, I'm assuming is when the person like, f it gets connected to the statue. What's this about, ma okay, mask, the masks should be something in the twins. What were they doing this for? <laughs> Man, I'm glad they have like the log for this stuff on the ship because god damn I need to reread shit a lot. Alright, what does this zoom call lead us to? Oh! Did you choose a spawn point? I don't think so. I don't think this has like a, um, a practical purpose. I mean, I guess it would if we could activate this guy. Not to mention, yeah, no, 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 never mind. It actually wouldn't make sense at all because we don't spawn where this, the other statue is. We spawn always in the same place, like that little the campfire by the, by the launch site. So even if we could pair with that statue, I'm not sure that would do anything. Fuck's sake. God damn it.
That felt way too short. God fucking shit. Fuck. How can I make it over there? Time for the sun to devour us all. Here we go. <laughs> Fuck do I make it there? Oh Jesus. I get oh wait, maybe when the gravity is all fucky. I think that yeah, that might be it. When we're in space, we can probably get to there. Yeah, there's even a f the, yeah, there's a there's a um, ah, there's a thingy there. There's another the um, uh, whatever those are called. Fuck the safe zones on that end as well. So you have to like wait on this one until you're in orbit, and then once you're there, you like make the leap over. I th wait, am I high? No, there is one. I see the ring over there. Right over there. Yep. Man! <laughs> there it is! <sighs> what the fuck, though? Recording memories. That shouldn't have anything to do with this happening, though, right? I can imagine, like, uh, yeah, but recording the memories for who? And how would you... What if you can access them? <laughs> the Ash Twin Project. <laughs> the Human Instrumentality Project. Every memory recorded by a Nomai statue is transmitted to a corresponding storage unit within the Ash Twin. Right. Nomai statues were designed to pair with a single user. Record their memories and send those memories to a storage unit with the fuck. It's within the Ash Project. Each storage unit inside the Ash Twin Project was equipped with a mass the storage statue's counterpart, which would then send those stored memories back to the corresponding user. Statues were designed to only activate once the Ash Twin Project succeeded or in the event that it failed. Sounds was worn in a microwave center like the one in our observatory. I found a Nomai statue lying on the beach. It looks just like the one in our observatory. Hi, Yui. How are you doing today? But... Nothing about this seems to, like, imply that it grants you some kind of, like, immortality. They do say that the... The meth... Wait. The, right, which could then send those stored memories back to its corresponding user. This the yeah. This doesn't imply the immortality. It does tell us how we're keeping the memories because we activated a statue, and it's keeping the memories. But like, no. But if you go. If when you die, 
you go back to the beginning of the time loop. The mask should not have those memories. Unless the mask is part of the loop, which does imply that it's related to it. How does that work? That's a fantastic question, Tarm. As they operate outside of the time loop. They, the masks did look like they were in kind of a not very logical place, right? When we use the when we use the zoom call, even though it said Ash Twin, Ash Twin, Ash Twin. Oh, it is still there. Never mind. Yeah, but when when we used the Zoom call fucking tablet, it definitely looked like fucking stars or something. It didn't look like you were in a place. What? What? What is that yellow thing there? What? Brain at work, same. Thinking is hard. But piloting is harder. Uh, water, 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 water. Where is it? Oh, there you go. Hmm. Well, now we have to see the other the other tanks to all also oh I can see the I can see the fucking lightning now did I really not notice that before Jesus I was really not paying attention what the fuck just like how I didn't realize that fucking brittle ho What the hell? Wait, was that the- was that- is- oh, that's the bits of the planet going in and out. <laughs> like, what the fuck is that? Holy shit. Wait, what happens if you fly directly into the core? Should be able to do that, right? Right? What the fuck is that? Oh wait, that's right. They said something about right, right, right. Okay, we have to find. We have to find the right type of uh, current. Um, shit. I don't remember which one was which. The giants is the deep. No, 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 no. It's not the. It's not the giants. It's um. It's the thing that they were talking about in the um. In the uh. In that other station. 
right? What the fuck? Okay, we'll look at that later. I want to get to the core now. Um, remember, like, the... How there's different types of, um, fucking tornadoes, whatever these are called. One pushes you upwards. And the other pushes you downwards past this current breed, like, because this p keeps you from going in. There's like a, a layer of um, current that keeps things at bay. But there's a kind of that. Well, that's not the one. Um, cl yeah, exactly. Cl clockwise and counterclockwise. I forget which one is which, though. Wait, can I see that here real quick? Uh, no. Uh, yeah. Shit. This isn't very helpful. Where did I even see that? I can't remember where I even found that information. Um. Cold Forge, Hanging City. Shit. Tornado simulation, there it is. Most cyclones of giants deep rotate clockwise. These are the cyclones that are used to send components into orbit. There also exists a rare type of cyclone that's been in the opposite direction, counterclockwise, and pushes objects beneath the waters and below the current. So counterclockwise, but the problem now is I can't fucking tell them apart. <laughs> um, why the fuck am I moving away? No, stop. Let me in. Like, that looks count. Is it counterclockwise? How do I even get here? Do I have to, like, go from above? Fucking Christ. Uh, whoa, wait a minute. Wait, 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 what the fuck? What the fuck? Ah. <laughs> wait. What the fuck? Holy shit. Oh, this must be like a, um, like a protective barrier. I'm thinking if I go here, there's not going to be any any of those funny little fucking um, like uh, gra uh, gra uh huh yeah those um <laughs> the safe zones for when you go into orbit because the storms won't come in here. Listen, okay, look, you <laughs> It makes sense, all right, it's a, it's it's a cylinder and it keeps you down <clears throat> Now what the fuck is this a big ass fucking tower dude It has to be important for it to be in such a like a like a safe location in such a um, unsafe planet, not to mention the fact that it's fucking huge. Be welcomed in this place. The tower shares with all who ask the knowledge needed to make his or her first qua.
I have to go pee. I... I have to, like... I'm gonna go pee, I'm gonna go... Uh, get my sandwich. Refill my water. Maybe feed my... Oh, Jesus Christ. Maybe feed my cats. I'm very sorry. Shinny, we have just arrived at the tutorial. This is the tutorial planet. And I'm only making it there now. Nine hours into the game. <laughs> oh, fuck. Only partially sorry for the timing. Um, but yeah, I'll, uh, I'll be right back. <sighs> Christ. Is everything else just the pre-cum? No. It was... This is the pre-cum that we were supposed to have gotten to. But I... You know what? I... Okay. I'm gonna be right back. <sighs> Fuck! <laughs> God damn it.
Holy shit. Hello. <laughs> Sorry about that. Forgive me here as I as I do the the um the eating. Uh fuck. There we go. Did I miss anything? You sound so upset. <laughs> I'm not upset, really. I think it's funny. I mean, most of all, I'm glad and I'm excited. I'm thrilled. That we're like suddenly gonna be able to make like a ton of progress. But I'm also like think it's very funny. The situation, you know? And how and how how this all unfolded. This is awkward, hold on. Let me get blank banshee again while I eat. There we go. You guys can still hear this, right? No, okay. Um, perfect. You're laughing, me too. Why though? What happened, you? What a very, what a extremely, extremely topical, extremely topical tweet from Girl DM. Yep. Yep. You and me both, brother. Nine hundred. <laughs> no, they say. I hope you know what they say. I don't. I don't know shit. I just made it to the tutorial. You know. Hope she doesn't matter. She she's Canadian. She'll be fine. I remember one time someone posted um. If you're not Canadian, what are you? And I replied, warm. And I replied, well, you got me there. <laughs> it was actually probably like one of the funniest interactions I've had with someone. Oh wait, actually, who the fuck? Oh, Gabbro is a guy on Giants Deep. Gotcha. Had to look that up. Have I seen that name before? I'm not sure. I I mean, maybe I have. 
It might be like in the in the notes and shit. Because I've come across like a few things where they're like, oh, um, fucking, um, this guy is in that place over there. And I'm like, oh yeah, okay, sure. I'll get there in a second. Turns out it was several seconds. Won't be too much long on, sorry. I know this is always like a little bit awkward. But between this and just like closing the stream off altogether. Or instead of saying I'll get there in a second or just a minute. People are extremely accurate like a whisker away. What is that? Japanese animated film produced by Studio Colorido. Toho Animation. <laughs> Arrive in 7 minutes and 23 seconds. On the dot. Barring any unforeseen circumstances. Of course. Of course. Boy, what? Well, why this movie make you feel attacked? You? I'm just reading like the... Well, not too... I, I try to re read like the first paragraph of the plot on, on Wikipedia. Not to like spoil myself or anything. I haven't heard of this before. Which, I mean, okay, well... Not that that's difficult. But yeah. Looks pretty. Can't say why I'm... Can't say why, tell you what, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I would have to watch the movie to understand, gotcha. Understood. That's kind of good though, you know? A movie making you feel called out. That's, that's something special about that. Feeling attacked still implies feeling seen or like having a movie that relates to you in some way. That's pretty cool. Even if it is an attack. Um, I was trying to find something. I saw this artist post this, um, they did more of these before. What the fuck? I was trying to find the earlier post. They're, they made like, um, um, a pressure. I, what, what does this translate to? Pressure. Yeah, I guess it's probably incorrect. It's like Twitter's auto translate thing, but they just like drew like other hollow live members, just like staring really menacingly. And Mary, <laughs> I never know how to say your name. Marine, Marine, 
I read that shit it's so fucking American. God damn it. I should just call her Sandro. That's what every, everyone does anyway. I can't find the earlier ones. I like those a lot though. This motherfucker posts too much. Uh, it's someone that has not watched or heard of Studio Ghibli. It's possible. I mean, it's rare for sure. It's pretty impressive. I don't know of a lot of shit, and even I have... Oh, they're here, they're here, I found them. Even I have, like... Well, not a lot, to be fair. I've seen, like, what? Three? Studio Ghibli movies? I think? Maybe? I watched the... Um... Wait, no, four maybe, actually. But I think two of them was like in a movie night or something. Probably Panda's movie night. So, like, I, I might have not been paying complete attention. What was it? It was like uh, Princess Monarchy and... Um... Shit, the one of, like, the... Ah! Ah, the water stuff. Fuck, what's it called? Ponyo? I think? Yeah, those are the ones that I don't remember as well. But then I saw Howl and the uh, Spirited Away. Um, Those two I remember more. Spirited Away I watched when I was like really young. And I did not even uh know that it was anime. I didn't even know what anime was when I watched it. There we go. I found the earlier one of that series. There we go. They're so good. They're so good. In that, in that, uh, in in the in the fucking in the second one that I sent, that is, it's the earliest one in the series. I love how they all have like a different angle. <laughs> It was just like facing different ways, fucking flare going like sideways. I love that. Alright. Just gonna go put this away. And we'll get back into it. Sorry for the hold up. Who's ready to fucking... Wow! T tutorial! We're about to learn how to play the game, guys! Exciting! <sighs> okay... Uh... Wait... Make sure that it's... Back up... There we go. Cool, cool, cool. <clears throat> okay. Here we go. 
So here's the fucking actual tower of quantum that's gonna tell us how to navigate that shit. Great, 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 great. This is sus. Uh, how tall is this? What the fuck, dude? Enter this place without a friends. However, these are lessons to learn for yourself. Not to worry. Not not a not something I have to worry about. Um. <clears throat> Uh, um, on God, just that wasn't scary at all. Seek the wandering arch. Wandering Arch. Oh my god. Oh. 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 What the fuck, dude? <laughs> hey, I wonder. It doesn't. Wait, but there's. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That makes sense, yeah. Shard. Okay. Gotcha. Right. Okay. So was this the signal we we're picking up from the planet? We got it? That's good. Observing a quantum object. Observing an image of a quantum object. Observing an image of a...
Wait, why? Is he getting insane? No, no, no. Wait, hold on. I need to check something. Sorry. Okay, okay. Not mine. I'm good. Wait, so wait, where can it show up again? Okay, I'm in, in the right place. He's cheating though. What the fuck? Okay. The image of a quantum object. Fucking joking. You're joking. <laughs> no, no, there's no, no, there's no, there's no way. There's no way. There's no way, right? There's no way. There's no way. Does that mean I was actually supposed to fucking shoot a scout into the moon? <sighs> I love this game. I, I, I really, really do. I really, really do, dude. So funny. Holy shit. What is oh oh okay 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 one of the, the gravity thingies gotcha the arch and the crystal do not naturally meet do not naturally meet so you have to force them to meet. 
by fixing one of them in place. You also have to be able to fucking use it. Uh, God damn it! Wait, hold on. Oh, maybe you need. Oh, because you do you, it, it. Right, right, right. Of course. Once it's out of reach, you're still fucking. Let's see, just take another one. Holy shit! <laughs> how the f how did they not know? Wait, they don't tell you this in the museum, do they? In Timber Earth, they don't know this. How? How do they not know this? What the fuck? <laughs> Oh my god, what? What is this? This is the last one, but we made it hard to... <laughs> Alright. Fair enough. But we made it harder. What the fuck? Can you, like... Oh, that's not enough. Oh, hey there, buddy. It's sad you're also time doing this. Yeah, that's brutal. Speaking of which, I should probably pause if I'm just gonna be sitting here fucking trying to figure it out. There's only two crystals. You can control one with your POV and the other with the drones, with the scouts. Fuck, Jesus Christ, I do not know how to operate this thing. Wait. So I don't know where the fuck it's supposed to be. Next? Can I? Oh, okay, well, I guess. Can I? Oh, okay. That wasn't so bad. Oh, except there's... No, that's on the other side. Oh, not always on the other side, I guess. Fair enough. 
Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my fucking god, dude. We offer our congratulations. You've learned the rule of quantum imaging. Take this knowledge with you on the remainder of your quantum pilgrimage. Remember, the other quantum shards have other lessons to teach. Our curiosity goes with you on your journey. You walk in the footsteps of those who came before you, and your path guides those who will follow later. So the Amber Twin shard is gonna have some other bullshit I have to learn before I can fucking land on the quantum moon. Right on time. Love to see it. That is the fucking coolest thing. We still didn't find the fucking counterclockwise thing. Which, uh... Did it take for you to song to come here again? Well... Because I kept mashing my head into the other planet. You know? I, I, I was aware that there was stuff in other planets for me to go to, right? You're constantly given hints that you're supposed to explore the other planets, but... I just didn't. My question is, why did I decide to go to Brittle Hollow first? <laughs> That's what I don't remember. Why did I make the decision of going to Brittle Hollow first? I don't know why I stayed there for so long, but... Oh, man. Wait. Does that... Wait. Does that mean... No, but they didn't... Write that... Because the thing there said that the other shards also have lessons to teach. But I don't think there was anything about the shard that's here. Was there? We only like, we only saw like a poem. Right? The other quantum shards have other lessons to teach. <laughs> Right. But... The shard... That's... In this planet... Wait, does that even show up here? What the fuck? Oh, there it is, Quantum Grove, right? 
There's a strange rock shard in this grove that moves right, 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 right. I found a poem written on one of the trees in the grove. And this doesn't say that there was like more to see there. Shit. It doesn't record what the poem is either. That's kind of um, unfortunate. I should go back there and take a screenshot. Hold up. Uh, how far was it? Like super close. It was like uh, uh. Wait a minute. Yo, wait. I haven't been here actually. <laughs> wait. Oh, wait, but it, this is the... Um, because this is a teleporter exit. Oh. Right? But we had found that you can't really get to... You, you can't use the... the um, the station that we know, that I forgot the name of, fucking Whitehall Station? You know the one. The one that we fucking should pay rent because of how often we go there. Um, what the? We can't use that one to go to other places, right? At least I don't think so. We always end up... We always what the wait is that the is that the weird shit? Is that the weird fucking ghost shit? Oh my god, it is. Why is this here? What the hell? Sus. Oh yeah, that's right. There's like fuck all gravity here. Well, still some, but. Oh. Oh, can make that jump. Um, but they did mention that there were like other fucking destinations. Oh shit! Tread carefully, you know. Good lesson. Watch where you're going. Don't just go ahead first. On the bright side, we found out what actually happens when you touch that shit. Up until now, we had managed to successfully avoid ever touching ghost matter. Nothing good lasts forever, am I right? <laughs> what the fuck was that place also? Is there something else there? I meant to find the, f the um, fun fact. Ghost matter turns you into a ghost. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We knew that. We just didn't know exactly, like, what it looked like when it killed you. Um, but yeah, we were warned that that shit hurty. Uh, is this the grow? Yeah, this is it. This is it. Okay, this is what I meant to find. But now I want to go back and see that other place. We're really, we're really getting back to our original, oh fuck, we're really getting back to our original pace of, um, of exploration, where we're literally just fucking scatterbrained, going like, ooh, what's that? And, yeah, which apparently might have been better, you know? Might have been a better uh, way to go at it. Where? Wait, but oh! I gotta head to work, have a great stream, take care, no worries. Thank you for stopping by, Panda. I love you too. 
good luck at work also. It's always hard to quiet shit across a bark. This moves too. Does that mean that? Wait. Wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is this also a puzzle? But why though? And. What the fuck? Should I trust my log and believe that there's nothing else to learn here? Yes? Okay, that's what I figured, but damn. Love the crunch. That's so sus though. What the fuck? I wonder if the poem's gonna mean something. That's some other point. Hmm. It seems very um, isolated, though, very contextual to where we find it. So that it doesn't seem super likely that it will mean something some other time. Could be wrong, though. I don't think this is the type of game where I should be taking anything for uh, granted. Is that the right word? So what the fuck is going on here? Okay, I died there. Oh, there's something on the other side of the waterfall, though. Mining's to be? Yo! Holy shit, let me in. Let me in right now. <laughs> Sorry. Um. <laughs> You have my undivided attention. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Let me in. Uh, let me into the tube. Fuck. God damn it. I 
can't see shit. Okay, there we go. This seems perfectly safe. Ugh. Pain. Okay, where? Do we know this shit's down here? <laughs> does, does anyone know this is here? I don't... I... <laughs> Granted, I haven't been paying, like, the most attention in the world, but I don't remember them telling us anything about... I'm still amazed by how much or the Ashtrin project requires. Isn't this the ore for remaining towers being built on the Ash Twin? The completed towers I've seen are quite large. No, the material for those towers is all being taken from Ash Twin. The ore we're mining here will be used to craft an immensely thick protective shell that will physically seal off the chamber inside Ash Twin's core. If they're sealing off all entrances, I hope they've played a... <laughs> pretty good hope they've played accordingly I thought you had forbidden your apprentice from making puns Coleus how else would they improve <laughs> excellent excellent I'm relieved by our clan's decision to use timber earths ore only for constructing the shell. If eventually life on this planet were to evolve to the point of advanced metallurgy, I'm c confident we won't have destroyed their ability to create. Wow, so considerate. Holy shit, imagine that. Imagine that. Imagine being like, hmm, you know what? Let's not completely drain the resources of this planet so that if, you know, other forms of life happen to use it at some other point, they'll still be able to. Fascinating attitude. Fascinating attitude. Imagine. Imagine having that attitude. Okay. We're once again in the Twilight Zone shits. This is the same as before, I'm pretty- well, I mean, I can't tell if it's the same because there's only- okay, there's- I think there were only three lit masks on the other one too. But yeah, this place looks strange. That's why it looks like that. That's the core they're talking about. And you can tell because it's made by this material. That's like super fucking sparkly in the dark. It's not stars at all. It's just really funny looking metal. Interesting. My gratitude for the latest shipment. This ore should be the last we'll need for the Ash Twin project. Once we finish the shell that seals off the central chamber, we'll check to ensure there are no longer any physical entrances. Rami and I will be checking the interior and then the exterior for cracks. Our final safety check. This is exciting news. Can I offer an extra set of eyes for this final check, specifically mine? <laughs> if my... If my work here is complete, I'd be delighted to help. We'd be grateful if you would. The more eyes, the better, as the smallest flaw or opening in the shell that protects the Ash Twin project could lead to disaster. Oh, speaking of disaster. Uh, Twitch? We good? Did anyone say anything after Tarm's think a oh, woe emote? Because my fucking chat like disconnected for a second there. 
or several. Is everything okay? Stream still up? No, ah, okay, okay. Weird. Maybe just a little, a little, a little hiccup. Very, very on brand for Twitch to do that. I have to say. Anyway, moving on. Oh, uh, okay. Interesting. I don't think there's gonna be anything else here for me to look at, but yeah, okay, that's fair. Hmm. So it was supposed to be sealed. Wait, can we look at the zoom call again? Actually? looks too yeah that looks too deliberate to be like cracks i was wondering if you could see from the inside if there were any any of the cracks that we're talking about um but yeah it doesn't seem like it not that i could see anyway that quickly because we we don't know if whatever they were trying to do succeeded or not because they said that the masks would work um either way either if the project fails or not um it would still um, oh okay so this is what was the other side um the masks would still work right they would start working if there was a if the project was a success and they would start working if the, there was a technical fucking issue which uh kind of questionable I, I i should say a bit weird <laughs> but you know who am i to, to question okay is there anything else i've missed here Surely you're not gonna tell me I can fucking enter the 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 the, the geysers. Even if you can, I don't feel like it. I want to go in the water again. I want to find. I want to get to the core of the planet. Find the counterclockwise, fucking counterclockwise uh, tornado. Get in there. You son of a bitch. It's you, isn't it? It's fucking you. That's the one. That's the one right there, officer. Is that the infamous moon? Yes, yes it is. 
And you can tell that it's it because it disappeared when you looked away. Which is, you know, the, the, the whole thing that it does. All right. Counter... Clockwise... This messes up with my brain so much. That one is going in a different direction. From the others. I think. Fuck. Whoa! There we are. Okay, what the fuck is going on here? What is this? What are those? What the fuck? A jellyfish? That looks very- oh, What the hell? I don't feel safe. Here. Yeah, j it just went in? Can we go in? Doesn't sound like anything. Can you send in this guy? Yep. Sure can. Oh, what the fuck? They bounce back? It did- what the hell is that? It like shocked it backwards. Turn. Okay. Sure. And what if we fly directly into a jellyfish? That means. Oh. Is that it? How to fix the old fucking. Dude, this looks like a. Um... Fuck, what do you call that shit? Electrical systems. Wait. Uh, are those outside the ship? I don't want to go there right now. Does not sound like a good idea. Whoa. It's dark here. Oh wait, that's right, I have to go from above, I think? Right? Hi Kaz! Just finished streaming, this game is messing me up. Which game? What well, is it the um that free one that I've seen a bunch of people play? Fucking... I can't remember the name of it. Tell me why. That's it. Is it good? Probably like three times so far and it's... Well, I mean... Kaz, I love you, but you telling me that a game made you cry does not say a lot. You know? I mean, character is trans. Pog! Listen, I'm listening. Go on. I know I cry out. Yes. Go on.
that's oh okay that's fair it's true I'm, i mean I'm, I'm glad i'm glad i'm glad you know that self-awareness is a is an important trait how the fuck did i get in here last time i just want to repair my fucking toaster Okay, that's cheating. So you can go in for- Okay, alright. I see how it is. I see how it is. Come on. Ugh. Fuck! God, son of a- okay, okay. We'll get there. We'll get there. I don't know why I'm putting in so much effort. Like, I don't even care that my electricals are down. Actually, wait, let me see what- let me see what it wrote in the log about this. Cause I have no clue- well, <laughs> I don't care about my electrics being down. Let me check my log real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking dumbass. I'm so stupid. <laughs> um... Oh, wait, there's literally like marks on the surface. That's how I can tell where the big one is, right? Oh, wait. I just realized maybe this doesn't work because the electricals are down. Never mind, we're good. But hey, I'm glad you're enjoying. I'm glad you're enjoying. That's good. That is poggers. I'm also enjoying. Did you know I just made it to the tutorial? <laughs> very cool. I think that's very cool. Oh, well, I guess I don't have to worry about it anymore. Uh, <sighs> yep. Uh, yep. The highest of poggers. So true, bestie. So true. Those are small ones. Where's the big guy? Does he be enjoying this game? I'm this like. There's no good way for me to talk about this, especially like right now. Um my current level of understanding of it. Oh, oh, oh my god, I accidentally made it. Let's fucking go. Uh, we're fine. We're fine. There. No point to this, but, you know, we made it. Easy clap. Can find out how to fix my electricals before the sun explodes. Oh, it's right here. Uh. 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 Almost. Uh. Fuck. Oh. Please. Just, just a little more. Just a little more. No, my honor as an astronaut. Never mind. We're good. We got it. I may die, but my ship was in perfect mint condition as we have been swallowed once again by the fucking sun. Alright. Now for the important question. Why would there be f jellyfish inside of a planet's core? What did we just see down there? We'll probably find answers on the other uh, stuff on the surface, but I can't. Dude, I'm still not sure if that thing is going like different ways every time we loop. It wouldn't make sense for it to do that, but it kind of feels like it is. Um. Okay. Ocean, de ocean depths. There we go. Oh, would a black hole be a planet's core?
how else would it collapse? Of course, the, pla the planet's core is a black hole. It's what's consuming the planet, you know? Makes perfect sense. How else is it supposed to disintegrate and, and, and fucking implode? Obviously, it has to be a black hole. No other, no other fucking thing could explain. <laughs> You'll make a good point. Yeah. Okay, true. So true, bestie. Did my mind's over? Right, right, right. Okay, we know this part. All right. The ocean is surprisingly calm beneath the currents. Some sort of electrical field surrounds the planet's core. A, <laughs> a jellyfish called jellyfish, by the way. Um, well, because they live in the water, so they're fish, and then they look like jelly. So they're jellyfish. I think that makes perfect sense. Um. Oh yeah, that's right. Fuck, we didn't actually. Yo, I gotta check out the, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta see what's, I gotta see what's on that other, the, the, that other, uh, wall of text on the other side of the water in that one room. So next, uh, next uh, loop, I'm going there for sure. Because they taste great with peanut butter fish. I cannot argue with that. That is truly the match made in heaven. Oh well, yeah, so it is like moving. It's not orbiting a single planet. Bitch. Um also hello the gaming lord. Welcome. Uh Yeah, we can do that. We can go check out that other wall. Of course, of course, of course, perfect sense. In between two breadfish, for sure, for sure. Let me in. <laughs> no, that's... <laughs> All right, buddy, now you're into for breadfish. Come on now. See what happens to bread and water? Well, but that's land bread, you know? Of course land bread doesn't do very well in water. It's not fish bread. Fish bread, on the other hand, on the other land, the land that's not land because it's water, does wonderfully. Fine, I'll go in here. Fine, I'll go check out the funny, the the funny the uh, Stargate shit. Um, how? What the fuck is happening here? Holy shit, please let me down. Good enough. Um, it's made of seaweed, so it's waterproof. Perfect sense. Wait, no, wait, if this is another fucking... I can't leave this here. Fuck! Shit, 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 shit. No, 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 no. Oh my fucking god. 
Oh my fucking god, no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh my... Wait, is it attached? Are we good? It looks pretty... It, it, I think... It, yeah, this looks... Yeah, we're good. We're good, actually. Not bad. All's well. Chip safe. I wasn't, though. Ship was fine. I... N me? I wasn't. <sighs> what can you do? Oof! Oh god, I wish I could make the Roblox oof sound with like my human mouth. That would be great. That would be so much power. Can you imagine? Holy shit. I couldn't tell if that was me colliding into the ship or if the ship got yanked out of the gravity. Um, the, 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 the funny sticky, sticky wall. Funny gravity. I could not tell which one of it, which, which thing happened. Wait. Oh yeah, that's right. It's moving between the, the places. Wait, what? I just, look, I just want to check if I can do it. I just want to check if I can just That's just cheating, bro. That's just cheating. He's fine. He's no clipping. Son of a bitch. What the fuck? Why does it curve like that? Well, okay. I mean, it is space. Fuck knows what happens out there. You bitch. What am I doing? <laughs> Bonk. Yeah, it just goes right through it. Just like me. Unlucky. Anyway. Uh, back to business. Where was I going again? I can't decide. I haven't seen this before though. That's exciting. Um, it also looks, oh geez. It also looks a bit unsafe. You know? Like there's no, um, there's, there's no... Is this... Outside? There's no like gravity safety measures or anything. This patch, this fucking island is just raw dogging the planet. No protection whatsoever. Where... 
Oh, wait, what? Ghost ma where? Glad you told me, because I don't fucking see it. Maybe there's no storms here? It does seem pretty close to the... I forgot how shit the jetpack is on this planet. Fuck! Okay. Yeah, maybe there's no storms here because it's close enough to the big... The big guy? It's truly is an extremely cringe moment. Fuck! Just going for a swim, you know? No biggie. No biggie. It's teaching me a valuable lesson. On how to, uh... Utilize my own body. Instead of always relying on the jetpack. Because that was essentially all I did in the other planet. Wait a minute. Is this like... Is this just basically like a point of entry that I could have used instead of being a dumbass? Oh. Uh, not quite. Not uh, quite. Um... Hmm. What is this, actually? Wait. Oh. Yeah, we haven't... We haven't visited whoever's on this planet yet. We will, though. Now, how the fuck do I... ...get around this? This is such bullshit. Why would you put a fucking... ...tunnel? And it works. Wait, I'm going to die again because of like that. Oh, that's why I died. That's why I died. It's because of fucking gravity. Because I'm being shot into the fucking orbit. And then when I come back down, I'm still like above and then <laughs> they're actually way to see ghost matter. It's those uh, crystals on the ground. Um, like on the inside of the of that uh, root, I don't know if you saw on the all around actually on the ceiling there was some as well. But there's these like funny looking crystals, like little crystal shards. They look like they would be painful to walk on, so it's a good it's a good tell. It's not your f it's not that fall that kills you. It's a sudden stop at the end. So true. So true, if only I didn't stop falling. That's my bad. That's truly my bad. Truly my bad. Just stop slower, just stop slower. Easy. No problem. Uh... The fucking... It's not it, right? Nah, you look too bumpy. Oh, where is my root rotund boy? There we go. Hello. Hello, my wet friend. Uh, 
aim at the ground and miss. You make a good point, actually. If I landed in the water, I'd be fine. Maybe. I wouldn't be fine, right? I mean, maybe it would take me like a little bit of effort to get back on land, but I wouldn't die, at least. It's true. That looked too close for comfort. And also, my theory was wrong. <laughs> that Alan really is just there raw dogging the planet. No safety, no nothing. Um, I didn't get to walk a lot on it, but it didn't seem like there was much there. And speaking of much, I f feel like it could be a good idea to meet up with the person who's set up. <laughs> what the? Oh, goodness me. That's a lot of damage. Fuck. Um. What? Good grief. This is the most fucking times I've inflicted damage on my ship. I don't even know what all the things that broke are. What the fuck? Oxygen tank damaged, autopilot damaged, cockpit damaged. Uh, wait. Huh? No, I don't think I will. Do it. Now what? Well, um, I think that's it. I can't even get like get on board of the ship. Now it's boring. Yep. Yep. That's all right. You know what? Good motivation. We landed on the right island. Actually, all of them would have been right islands because we haven't been to any of them. But, um. We are on the right island. For me to go do the thing that I said I was gonna do earlier. You know the one. Quick, 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 quick. Now we don't know exactly when the next fucking thing is gonna pass, but I guess we just stay here until it does. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> Bad job. It's a reasonable thing to want to know, you know? It's only fair. I would have done it too, eventually. Possibly on accident. But now we know. We're not supposed to do it. That's fine. Maybe I can get to other islands just through the water. Maybe? Science, exactly. Life's an adventure. Get a fucking uh, stethoscope. That's for doctors, right? Get a telescope. Yeah, that's the one.
trying to hear if it's like getting any closer, but. Oh, wait, I'm stupid. This is just the... Um, I thought this was places. Now I get it. This is just explaining how the mask system works. Gotcha. I mean, why were they... <laughs> was it that complex to, for people to understand? They literally had to draw a picture? It seems pretty straightforward to me. Hear the wind. Here he comes. Oh. Let's fucking go. Am I good? Oh dear. Wait, can I? Oh, okay. I was like, am I trapped here now? Oh, too much, too much. Too much. Okay. Okay. Easy. Nice. I'm curious. Is sending a being's memories back in time... Is sending a being's memories back in time the same as the sending the being itself back in time? As an example, if we were to send my memories back in time... Can I... My, cause, okay, thank you. Is that the same as sending me back in time? Not my physical body, but my answers. My essence. I read essence as, 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 as I read you saying answers. It became esser, essence. I imagine they're two different actions. Wouldn't both actions be effectively the same? Suppose that time has, was being rewritten. I believe that I believe this is different than receiving memories from what is effectively the future. But isn't the result identical in either case? That did wait that that didn't update the the log did it why I mean I guess it's not like super crucial that ship log is being kept up to date I mean we can ass we okay we can assume that that's just us riding on it you know that makes sense to me. Like, sure, we don't directly do it, but we can ass we can assume that it's implied that it's our doing. I should probably just die here somewhere. But now it explains how the whole thing's working. Oh, hey, this is that place from before. Can I... Uh. Do I stay stuck here? I feel like I don't. Speaking of oxygen... Ah. Wait, why is this up? That doesn't seem right. Oh, okay. Easy. See? Can't even make it through other- Who needs- Who needs this ship anyway? Am I right? Ships. <laughs> Just swim, dude. <laughs> Just swim, literally. 
This is it. We've finished building the final orbital probe cannon module and are ready to send it off into orbit around Giant Sleep for assembly. To all my friends here at the construction yard, that's what this is. My gratitude for your tireless work. I had given up hope, but I truly believe this cannon may actually succeed where matter of many other attempts have not. Are you going... <laughs> gelatinous on us? <laughs> <laughs> delighted by your words, but they're atypical for you. If I'm ever half as gooey as Mallow and a a Avens behave together as, you may launch me f you may launch me from the orbital probe cannon. If I know my brother Avens and his spouse will want to launch the probe with as much power as possible. I'm worried the cannon would break under the strain. I propose we give Avens and Mallow a slightly lower maximum power setting than the absolute maximum possible to create room for their enthusiasm. Doesn't seem like it worked out. Our next step will be to send Privyat up to the orbital probe cannon to install the probe tracking system. Probe tracking system. There it is, it's the model of the thing, of the cannon. Poggers. Huh. See, so this is where they built the thing. Then sent it off into. Wait, is that it? Anything else to see here? Sus. Sus. Very. <gasps> ah. Fucking hell. Very sus. Hmm. Jesus. Ah, hold on now. Hold on. Hold on. There's stuff on the other platforms. Control module projection stone. This is the this is the thing that breaks. This is the thing that breaks around the planet's orbit. Okay. Twelve minutes, ten seconds ago, long range probe successful launch from the orbital probe cannon. Ah, uh, bad news, Evans. Yaro says there was a problem with the proposed power source, so the orbital probe cannon won't be asked to fire. I hope you're pulling my loc <laughs> locomotive limb here, guys. Tell Privyat and Malo they should return from the cannon. My spouse and I will remain at the construction yard for now. An update. Mallow and I will join you and Daz. Privet left to visit her brother. She fears Idea may feel responsible. I wish I were, my friend, but no, they aren't certain they can fix the problem, so the orbital probe can is on an indefinite indefinite hiatus. Wait, problem. What problem? What happened to it? Jesus Christ, this is trippy. Holy shit. <laughs> My brain. Ugh. Ah. Wait, why is this here? On the other side. What the fuck? Okay, uh, uh. <laughs> it's so weird. <laughs> uh. Come 
Connery, Daz and I were lifting the orbital probe can components of the orbital assembly and one somehow sank down beneath the current. She had seen it. We thought it was impossible for any cannon components to sink even partially below the current, but ours sank straight to the co Wait, we've seen this before. I'll try to recreate the phenomenon myself using it. Our counterparts were very good. So what happened? I could have sent it past with the current. My gravity field. Exciting spike constructed a model of. Cr okay. Yeah, yeah, we've seen this. Yeah. So this isn't gonna be, this is just gonna be the fucking, um, pool model. Yeah. Son of a bitch. Hey, you guys remember when we came here to this planet? Good times. Good, good old times. Where else can we end up? Just swimming around. That was supposed to be foreshadowing. <sighs> you know, some rules are meant to be broken. I can't wait. So, can I not use the fucking tornadoes on foot? Hi, TTB. Factory still streaming is the only thing that. Can oh my god, wait. What happened? Are you alright? Oh, they disappear. That's so weird. <laughs> oh, shit. They literally get like yeeted out of the planet and then just fall back down. <gasps> oh, shit. I d wait, signal. Yo, wait, signal. Oh my god, wait, we're finding the guy. Wait, we're finding the guy. What the f <laughs> <laughs> You good? Nice, it's you. Good to see you made it here in one piece. The first solo launch is a doozy, isn't it? It's a doozy. Um. I'm simply having a rough time. Are you okay, though? I'm, I'm glad I can help you feel better, but damn. I hope it gets better. We need the ship. I mean, I'm sure his ship is... Or sorry, their ship is around your summer, but... The fact they're just chilling on a fucking hammock... In a planet then like, keeps... Launching stuff. Okay, you know what? So, hey. Don't freak out or anything. But lately, I keep, like, dying repeatedly? What the fuck? They know! It's me too, we're in the time loop. Time has been behaving unusually lately. Yeah, time loop makes sense. Cool. You're taking this pretty well. <laughs> right back at you. Personally, I like the new experiences. I've never been in a time loop before. I mean, I don't think I've been in a time loop before this one. <laughs> it looks like you and I are the only ones who can tell that time has been gone all weird. I tried radioing Hornfells and asking if they died too, but they thought I was being metaphorical. <laughs> Even if I tell Hornfells about the time loop, they never remember by the next one. They don't realize every anything's different. And here's another weird one for you. Every time I die, all my memories from that loop replay back to me. I'm pretty sure that's related to this big Nomai statue I found in one of the other islands. It is, my friend. 
I was looking at it and the statue opened its eyes and started glowing. It replayed my memories like it's seen through my own eyes. It's just like what happens each time I die. That happened to me with the statue at the museum. You too, huh? Then the Namai statues must have something to do with why we're the only ones aware of the time loop. So no glowing statue, no time loop awareness? I think that's going to be my leading theory. But if you find out anything new about the statues or the time loop, let me know, okay? I'll be here. Um... If anyone hugs me right now, it starts... <laughs> oh, no, TTB, I'm sorry. That's just, just don't feel great, sir. No, 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 it's okay. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Thank you for sharing. I appreciate you feeling comfortable enough to telling us. To feeling comfortable enough to tell us. English is fake. Um, Gabriel's best. I mean, categorically, they kind of have to be. Because, you know, they know what's up. They know what's up. Are you trying to tell someone else that we're fucking dying and looping? And they're just like... You've been... You've been touching the, the fucking ghost crystals, bro. This guy, though. This guy. Um... I'm doing good TTB also, thank you for asking. Really, I mean, you can tell by the fact that I'm, you know, still streaming. Um, that I'm really fucking enjoying this game. <laughs> anyway, that's what's new with me, but hey, it's your first solo voyage. Kind of. Let's talk about it, you know? How's space treating you? Um, where's your ship? That's a good question. <laughs> It's definitely on this planet somewhere. I mean, unless a cyclone came by and tossed it into space, I guess. <laughs> that would be pretty nuts. Hope it's not lonely. Have you ever watched a cyclone for so long it started to hypnotize you? I'm telling you, they pull you in a trance if you stare at them long enough. <laughs> this guy is so chill. <laughs> Nice, nice, what you got for me? I reached the inside of Statue Islands. So that I might create those head statues to record memories, huh? Yeah, I can see that I might doing that. Not sure what for, but it seems like they're a sort of thing. Do you think the statues are recording our memories then? Because I remember that one on the beach, look at me funny. I must be my memory friend. Um, your quantum poem? Yeah, the one of the woods. I rem oh, wait, you wrote that? Oh wait, I get it because they're separate signs. I didn't I, I didn't even notice that. But it makes sense, so like every time you look at it, the verses are in a different Oh my god. <laughs> Yo When I'm done exploring I want to make some more quantum art. Maybe some kind of creature sculpture that just like shows up and scares the daylights out of you. <laughs> Alright, Stephen Wolfhide, calm down. Um, Where should I explore in Giant's Deep? Here's something you might like. At the start of every time loop, I keep seeing a bright flash in the sky at the start of every loop. Something was happening up there and we've seen that. What else? Have we been to Statue Island? That's what we've been calling it. Seeing as the island we're Yeah, yep, yep, yep. 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 Uh, it's a nice speech for that kind of thing. I get a solid 7 out of 10 on the Gabber relaxation scale. Yeah, they seem like a good source for, like, chill reviews. 
If you like checking out the statue island, it's the one with two islands connected by a natural rock arc. Well, mostly connected anyway, you'll see. Um, what are you doing out here? <laughs> what are any of us doing here, really? Nah, I'm just kidding. I want to hear exploring our solar system, same as you. But I tell you what, our space really gives you room to think. It's quiet and peaceful out here. I mean, it's usually quiet and peaceful. Sometimes a cyclone comes by and lifts my little island paradise clean out of the water. Then, less peaceful. What's up with this planet? <laughs> I know, right? Oh, you meant like, tell you more about it? Gotcha. Well, Giant's Deep is massive and mostly water. No surprises there. There's a strong current a ways beneath the surface that prevents anything from sinking below it. Seriously, I tried everything I could think of to get past that current. <laughs> I tried everything I could think of to get past that current and neither idea <laughs> As for land masses, I've counted four islands, including this one. Uh, there's also the one with the Nomai statue I saw on the beach. Wait, four islands, including this one. Plus the Nomai statue one? You seen the cyclones? Yeah, they're hard to miss. I'll toss up everything in their path, islands included. Little tip, if you get picked up, try to land on Yeah, you know, good tip, good tip, less likely to kill you, um, take it easy out there, hey, take it easy, oh my fucking god, you're vibing next to this shit, Uh, wait, is this? It looks like it, but it's not giving me the warnings. Weird. It, I, I think it's ghost matter, but it's not being detected as it. Because your suit is jacked up. I think my suit is fine. My body isn't, though. Um, oh, maybe the ship? That, that, would, that would be interesting. Oh, there we go. Now he got detected. That's weird. Why the fuck is there, like, just a, a patch there on that tunnel? And why doesn't it detect from here? That's weird. Oh fuck. Could I make it to the top before the next... Express... Tornado trip. Oh fuck. They're not even by their campfire. Incredible. Wait. Oh. Wait. Why? Is this island like? What's the word? Like stuck? It seems like it, doesn't it? Now I'm zooming, yeah, the others are moving, but this one seems like it's just here. Huh. 
those off. Wait, really? Can I do that? Won't I just die? What the fuck? That's new. I can catch up with that. Also, I'm like trying to count in my head how many islands we've been to. How do I navigate this island also? Are those jellyfish? They seem... I'm not sure what they seem like. I don't... Not totally sure that they're jellyfish. They seem to... Um, the color is kind of close. Maybe they are. They look like some kind of water thing. Maybe they're breadfish, you know? I still don't know how to get up here. Wait, could it be that I just can walk on this route that I couldn't before because my fucking ship was in the way? Uh. Hmm. Oh yeah, no, that's... Not quite right, because I don't have fucking jetpack power to make it up there. Holy shit. Uh, I have to actually take my ship and land on where that- on that part of the island. Because there's no other way across. Time to restart! And there's no way past the uh, ghost matter? Not that we know of. Or that I know of, at least. I thought that maybe... Um... Maybe when this island was sent to space, we could make it across to the other bit. But then that doesn't really work because it, that's, you know, unsafe to use the space strip as a means of navigation. Because then the, gra the fall will kill you. So you have to land on the water, but if you land on the water, there's no way to make it across. So, I have to land my ship on that side. There it is. Wait, it is shooting in different directions. No, I'm right about this. I think. Wait, am I. Oh, fuck. I can't. God damn it. I can, I can never remember exactly. I'm almost sure, though. Fuck. Not completely sure though. Man. Anyway. Let's get to it. Funny jellyfish island, here we go. That might be it though. For 
Oh, we do need to go to here as well. Wish I were a jellyfish. Do you? I don't know. I don't, I don't know much about jellyfish. Aren't there some that like poison you? Like if you touch the if you touch the the, the um, just float, no brain. Do they not have brain? That's so cool. Celebrities, they're just like us. They do not. Wow. That truly is a poggers moment. Oh. Amogus. Alright, alright. Funny ja Oh, there it is. Wait, but it's about to get fucking yanked. Man. Where do I even land? I don't think there's a good place for me to land the ship, like, on that part of the island. Wait, no, there's fucking ghost matter all over the place. I literally cannot navigate it at all. How the hell? <laughs> what the fuck? What is this? Ghost splooge. God, I wish. It would be less difficult to navigate than this shit. Do you remember the first time you encountered ghost matter? Fuck. That was in the real tutorial. I don't remember what they said about it then. Yo, it's the guy's ship! There it is! We found it! Can I make it inside? Uh, but no, I don't remember actually. <laughs> All I can remember is that they told me that it's bad, no touchy. I could go back in the VOD and see what they said. I can't get in this, can I? I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh, yeah, this shit closed, dude. Can't make it in. Man. Can't you go there again? I could do that. I could do that. I could do that. I could do that. You're right. You're right. You're right. I could do that. It's not like they're gonna find it weird that I'm asking about it again. Because, you know. Gotta go for now. Take care, everybody. Bye, Tarm. Thank you for hanging out. Be safe out there. Um, alright. I don't remember what the fuck our home planet looks like. Uh, that's not it. No, that's the sun. No, 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 no. We're not going into the sun. Hmm. No, that's Brittle Hollow. Hey, what is that thing? I just saw that. That's not the. Wait, is that the twins? No, the twins are over there. What the fuck? this thing? What is that? What the fuck? Oh no, wait, I, uh, we have seen that before, I just... 
can't remember what it is. If I even found out. Oh well. I'm so lazy, I'm literally like a half considering just taking off the suit and, you know, just jumping into space to reset, but we'll do it right. We'll, we'll, we'll go in there, we'll try to land, we'll try to be civil, civil people, not using fucking a death loop as a means of locomotion right now <laughs> um perfect landing time oh yes oh yes oh um How fucking far off course was I? Jesus. Okay. The autopilot is so, like, meticulous about this. It makes me feel like every time I try to land on a planet, I'm kind of just fucking eating myself at it and hoping for the best. <laughs> fucking autopilot's like a matching, a matching uh, planet uh, velocity. <laughs> Accelerating towards planet. Firing retro rockets. At like 10 kilometers away from it. Like holy shit. The autopilot's so much better at this than me. Damn. Probably are. I kind of am. I kind of am. It's true. Autopilot complete. Under under shot target. What does that mean? Uh. Oh. Five thousand bars. Five seconds. Yo. I don't see this one a lot. Thank you for the host, Kaz. Was that it? Was that was it you? Thank you. I don't remember seeing this before. I didn't know it would send it. Of course, it would send a notification. What do you mean? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh wait, no. This is just a, okay. Never mind. I'm stupid. Um. Well, you, yeah, of course. It's basically just like a raid, except less flashy. And also, it doesn't, for, because Twitch likes to be a fucking prick, it doesn't get uh, recorded in the activity feed if it's like under a certain amount of people, which is so stupid, honestly. That's why, like, um,. Paul, in particular, I think Paul does does this a bunch. When Paul hosts me, with like, oh my god, okay, well. <laughs> the timing. <laughs> Hi, Gwen Marie. Welcome. Thank you for the raid. Welcome everyone from Grim's stream. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> so, uh, that that could possibly be a bit of uh, mischaracterization. Kagura, ay ay, ay ay, 
fuck. I'm gonna misread that name like a weeb every fucking time. But hello, welcome. Um, Grimmery is here. Welcome. How was your stream? What were you you Overwatch? Did you play comp? Did you or were you still leveling? So I read it like a weeb. Kaguya. Ah yeah yeah. Um, Mjolnir, hello. Aura, welcome back. Uh, Shad, hello. Welcome, everyone. How are y'all doing? What's going on? Uh, also, by the way, I, I'm supposed to, like... When people raid, like, I, I guess I'm, like, gotta, like, introduce myself. Hello? Uh, Shanzical here. Uh, alleged variety streamer. But I'm very lazy and I don't play a lot of uh, games now, so I stream a lot of Overwatch. Um, except for today! Look at this! We're not playing Overwatch, we're playing Outer Wilds, which by the way is a fucking sick as hell game. Um, I always scream that funny animal name that I don't know how to read out loud on Umu voice when I see or hear anyone say it. That is... God bless. That's a mood. That is extremely relatable. Not for that word in particular, because I really legitimately don't know how to fucking say, uh, say it. Um... Interesting. Um, it's a tick. Could be worse, I think. Uh, ironic community is Mr. I I'm contractually obligated to still introduce myself, though. You know, that's the that's the streamer thing to do, right? Um, so on today at the zoo, Pog. My sub badge and I can't pronounce the name. You know what? I need to unveil this mystery now. Um. Axolotl. Axolotl. What the? F You're joking. That's not a real word. You're joking. What? Axolotl. 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 Axolotl, be going to bed now. Be a good stream. Thank you, or a sleep well. Thank you for stopping by. What the fuck? Is I, dude, this is what Google is telling me. That it is how you read it. Axolotl. Axolot. Man, it sure does. It sure does ask a lot of questions. Ask a, a, the axolotl. Yep. And that's me, alright. That's me playing this fucking game. Asking a lot of <laughs> Um Groom is explaining about the badge and I'm not listening to really hear that. I was just Axolot! <laughs> Should be on tape. That is a good thing to be on tape. <laughs> huh? Hello, Axolotl. <laughs> okay, wait. So this fucking guy is telling me that this shit evaporates. What do you mean? Also, wait. When they say camera, did they mean like, do I have to use the fucking scout? Ha. Huh. 
by everyone else who aren't my wife. <laughs> that sounds like a that sounds like a challenge, Aura. That sounds like that sounds like you're challenging people to become your wives. And honestly, respectable. Um Evaporates over time. It takes a super long time. Does that mean that, like, towards the end of a cycle, ghost matter just, like, isn't anywhere anymore? That would be an interesting way to, like, tell how far in you are into a cycle also. Um, okay, sure. Uh, what? Okay. Uh, Mrs. Dram, I want to thank you. You helped me relieve my passion for Overwatch. Really? Wow. With feedback. Oh dear. Wait, this sounds bad. Have I, what? What misinformation have you heard from me? Do not listen to anything I say about that game. Okay, I do not know a single thing. I open that game, my brain shits off. I go on autopilot and that's it. I black out for the rest of the next, like, two hours. And then I stop playing and I'm like... Well, that was fun. Um... <laughs> Watch the stream or else. That is a little bit threatening. That is a little bit threatening. Wait, did you did you want to clip me saying axolotl? Cause I can do it better. I, I can I can one up that you know. I can one up that. Did you learn about the ghost splooge? It I mean we learned two facts about it. One is that it's actually visible through a camera i forgot that it's not really the 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 i need to stop making gestures to explain things in this game because so far i did this to explain the little gravity safe zones and now this to explain the crystals on the ground that exude fucking ghost matter so i should stop like using my hands when i talk maybe um Someone clip if it happens? Hold on. <coughs> Axel! <laughs> there you go. Um... Uh, the shad you are gaming you are good at the game yeah <laughs> oh my fucking stop I'm so okay I'm sorry I'm sorry I hope this does not lead you down a dark path of playing overwatch which let's be real is a very questionable activity a lot of people will tell you playing overwatch <sighs> danger danger <laughs> but i don't watch your job <laughs> um okay let's see then we'll try to find the fucking funny island again and I guess first we can take a look at the what the ghost matter looks like. And then... That... That's why... That's why... There's a thing, the campfire, to wait! 
on the same island with the... Oh, wait, I get it. I mean, maybe that's not why, but it I it sounds likely. Is making money from tournaments? How much lower can you go? You were making money. That's already a, one step above just the grinding path to pro. I mean, they call it path to poverty for a reason, you know? You were making money. <laughs> That's already a step above that. <laughs> Imagine making money. <laughs> yeah, the... Uh, yeah. yeah, imagine... Imagine that. <laughs> How much put extra 40 is extra 40. Exactly. Money is money. <laughs> Axolotl. Um. <laughs> Porgus. That's a Porgus moment. As, as Cloudy would say, fuck me, I cannot stop thinking shit in my head in Cloudy's voice. Get in the house. Can we save that somewhere? <laughs> Never I mean, it's a clip, so it's gonna stay up forever either way. The wheel is spinning, but the hamster is dead. You know what? I'll, I'm joining the hamster every 30 minutes because that's just how this game works. You just die all the time. Hey, quick question. Does anyone here have thalassophobia by any chance? I feel like that's a... Not, now that we got a bunch of new people here, I feel like that's a valid question to ask because this planet is not going to be fun to look at if you do. Um... What? Oh! Okay, okay, let's find the island. Let's find the island. Uh, oh shit! Wait, oops. That's, uh, that's, that's, that's a bit of damage. That's a bit of damage. Hold on. Um. So that my clips bookmark folder, TTB is the ultimate clutch. God bless. God, Louis, was that it? Wait, no, it's not. Fucking son of a... There we go. Good as new. Easy peasy. I was ocean, but sharks in the sea of these make me cry a couple of times. Oh, okay. You're good then. There's a couple of jellyfish in the fucking core of the planet. No sharks. No, wait. Mm, there is a big... <laughs> there is kind of a shark, but in a different planet. We'll not be going there for a little bit, though, I think. Uh, what am I looking for? No sharks. I'm bad with jump scares. I feel that. That is a... Large mood. Colossal mood, even. Um... Man, where the fuck? <laughs> like, hmm. It should be closed now, completely forgetting that these islands are fucking swimming around. Nothing is stationary in this stupid fucking planet. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, tree? 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 No, wait, that's the construction site. Um, jump scares, not sharks. Gotcha. Perfectly understandable. Dude, I swear to God, am I gonna keep fucking running into the same three islands? Oh, 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 there it is, there it is, there it is. Hello, hello. Hello. Oh, God. Oh, dear me. Okay, okay, okay. Not, oh. 
We good? Alright. Nice. Very nice. I see. We get swept by the tornado. Oh, I will. I will. Okay. Interesting. Oh, okay. So it's not blocked off. I'm just fucking stupid. Let's go. Please, please let my little piss trickle fucking jetpack. Ah. Okay, we're good. Um, didn't realize I streamed for exactly four hours and twenty minutes. That's how you know it was a good stream. The hamster died ten years ago. It's time to. <laughs> it's time to let go. Son of a fucking God damn it. Wait, so there's nothing I can do here then. <gasps> I mean like cool, I can make it to here, but what then? Ay ay ay. It's literally just like a barrier there. I mean, not that that's gonna like help me because. Wait, can I just? Okay, that's sick, homie. But why would I? Oh, oh shit! No, 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 no. Please, just let me... Okay. Okay, as long as the log updated. We're good. We're good. Alright, a uh, quick warning. Um, we're about to be engulfed by a supernova. It's going to look very blue. It's not, like, super sudden, but, you know, just letting you know ahead of time so it doesn't catch you off guard. Um, is there anything else here? I hope this recording tells me something about whatever the fuck that is. There it comes. There it is. Uh, it, it didn't look quite blue this time because this planet... Um, it's kind of weird. Because like the atmosphere, it has... Um, it seems to have a layer that makes it seem like perfectly flat from the outside. Um... And then you breach that layer, and it's like water. How do you get in by the supernova? Okay, so, um, the way this game works is you're essentially in a very small scale, um, solar system, right? I can pull up the map here to show you. But you can see just from like how the how the space travel works, how the planet looked there when when we were flying around. Everything is like super small. Um. Hey, hello. There we go. Um. This is the solar system, right? It the sun. It hungered. Yeah, the sun's hungry. It eats us. And uh, as we all know, um. A healthy eating habit. Good meal every 30 minutes? I don't actually know what's the recommended time, and I don't actually know how long you have per loop before the sun explodes, but the joke was there. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, you have the, you're have you exploring this sort of like mini solar system, and the sun 
naturally um, collapses into a supernova, just like it does in real life, except it does very quickly. I guess to go along with the theme of it being like super small scale through time, yes. But because of a mystery we're trying to um, solve, our memories get saved. Which is what happens uh, after that supernova and you get like all those images flashing by. That's the memories being like sent to us. And we don't really know what's up with that. Uh, and we've only found one other person uh, who's going through the same. And we found that it has to do with some kind of a statue from a previous civilization that we were um, investigating. Um, that they made and that they were working on some kind of thing to record memories and shit. But yeah, this game is a constant, what the fuck is going on? You're always asking questions. Edge of Tomorrow, I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. Sounds accurate though. We are on the edge of tomorrow. And technically we're on the edge of a lot of tomorrows because the, di the day cycles are... <laughs> Traveling between planets, you know? Time gets kind of fuzzy. What the fuck, bro? What? What do you want? Weirdo. Um... Gabbers Islands. Right, right, right. Am I the statue? Okay, right, right. I wanted to see if they wrote anything about that... Recording. Shit. Kitty, yes. He is here. Okay, Bramble. <clears throat> Sorry, Bramble Island. A lo an island of thorny vines and what appears to be a frozen jellyfish. It looks like Feldspar camped here before heading off to Dark Bramble. Huh. Wait, but you reached the core? Fuck, I wish I, I wish I had seen what the fuck was in the log and I wasn't just like speeding through it. Um It's a film where our main character is a science fiction soldier at the time of Groundhog Day. He dies and gets sent back with all the skills and memories. Right, right, right. Uh it's based off a of manga somewhere. <laughs> I am a weeb, but I'm a very uncultured weeb, <laughs> so all my weeb knowledge is extremely surface level. Um, no, the giant model for the orbital probe can center orbit around giant steep. Using my protection pull side, the interior of a space station, the orbit around giant steep. Okay, okay, okay. Um, the same bright flash that we see, the start of a loop, right? Uh, according to my computer, Long Range Pro was recently launched from the Orbital Probe Cannon. That's probably what we're seeing on the orbit. Shame on you. I take pride in my massive gaps in culture knowledge. This applies to every medium. Every type of medium. It's everything. There's always shit that... I People are like, you haven't seen or read or heard, you know? Everywhere. Uh, not even a weeb, but I know pop culture. My brother is a weeb, sir. Fuck. No, and can bully people like you. Absolutely. Absolutely. Even if you didn't know it, you know, you don't need to pass the bully weebs. They're weebs. You, you know, it, it's kind of expected that you would that anyone would bully weebs. They're weebs. That's what you do to weebs. What the fuck are you doing? What? 
It's a shadow, homie. You know what they look like. You've seen them before. What? What? Meow. 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 Poor malnourished. I can't see anyone walk around the house. I'm gonna start crying. I can be bullied for oh dear. That is that is that is a dangerous community to be involved with in these days for sure. I really can't say it. I don't know anything about it. But yeah. I'm on Twitter, so I know that they are under a lot of fire a lot of the time. She just can't be like, meh. Do you guys want to see him? He's just crying. Yes? Okay. Okay, one second. Hi, Narbs. How you doing? Name? His name is Speedy. Two cats? Three. Is he dumb? Yes. Oh shit, you saw her. Come in. Can I come say hi too? How are you? Hey, come here. That one's pirate, uh, and the other one that ran away is a uh, Mike, or you can call her Mike if you want to. You know, it's up, up to you. She doesn't mind. Um, Red right, cats are dumb. He is extremely dumb. He fucking what? <laughs> um, it's uh. It's the name of an Elder Scrolls character. Um, <laughs> you sp you spell it like this. Um, <laughs> he he's a Khajiit, you know, like the the race of uh, furries from the Elder Scrolls. Um, she was the only one that I named. The other ones were my parents that named them. 
<laughs> to what language nerd true true um but yes it's speedy pirates and Mike. they each have their own individual methods of being held as you could see speedy you can literally just like fucking like you know like i did i i can't explain he's very stupid he is the dumbest fucking cat i've met this motherfucker runs into walls he trips on himself he's just <sighs> he eats food so fast he pukes because he ate it so fast um It's <laughs> not really grim. You good? Orange boy cats have no brain cells. I've heard. Yeah, I've been. I've. I've heard. Mike the liar. Exactly. Exactly. That's the one. That's the one. Mike knows much. Tell some. Mike knows many things others do not. That's my... I don't make a good impression. I don't know how to speak like they do. Um, I'm starting to think I'm your cat. Stop running. Does your cat also know much? Tell some. She knows some shit. She is the huntress here. She'll like know when there's like bugs around the house and shit. She won't tell us where though. I had two red cats in Switzerland. Romeo was the dumbest cat I've seen in a little town. I played a lot of us who was too sleepy and lazy to do dumb shit. <laughs> uh, Pirate is like really lazy and sleepy as well, but like every so often he'll get like. Narvis, please do not say that. Do That's cursed. I want dogs in the future. I used to have, well, I mean, I was too young to like really say that it was my dog. It was like my mom's dog. But yeah, I remember having dogs around. They're fun. But a hedgehog now, he'd be called Sipe, and I'd love him. Yeah, I... <laughs> TTB, you good? What the... I don't know what that means. Frix Dola. <laughs> <laughs> Go greed. <laughs> yeah. Why not? I think that's a pretty solid king. <laughs> anyway, um, <laughs> where the fuck was I? Uh. When you're falling asleep and you feel like you're falling, I hate that shit so much. God damn. If you play, I see. I'm gonna be real with you. A lot of the things in that list really don't work. Are, are just... Objectively, just not kinks. Uh, like, we just started, like, writing down random shit in there. Hello? Hello? Probably is, I mean, for some people, for sure. But, unbirthing. You know? Wait, we're act. Oh my god. I was- I wanted to put off going here for as long as possible, but...
Shad, listen. The thing is, you taunted Nightbot. And... You know, Nightbot is sentient. Nightbot knows the stuff you're saying. So if you ask it to not fail you, it will. It will do it despite you. Oh, is it? Oh, oh, you spoke. I was like, wait, where? Why is the funny input not working? And it's because you didn't spell Nightbot. And I am the first one to defend. Uh, listen, anything is valid, but. There's the one fucking clip. You know the one? Do I know the one? Fuck. I have so many clips of like Nightbot just becoming iRobot. Why must the AI overlooked it? Cock and ball torch. <laughs> Oh fuck. God, was that a clip? I think wait, it was, wasn't it? If it wasn't a clip, I like I made it um like a Twitter thing probably. It might be in the um it might be in the thing in the um in the uh in the Shanzy Clips channel somewhere in there. It's even harder to fucking tell now because it's, wait, okay, wait. Actually, no, it might be easy because you still get the like video previews from Twitter videos. Oh, this is it. I think this is the one. I think this is the one. I think this was the one. Uh, where's my screen? I am upset spaghetti, a soggy noodle. That is tragic. What is, what is troubling you so, Shad? It's this one, isn't it? Monster Schlong? Is that what you wanted? Is that what you wanted? I miss the duty. <laughs> Cock and ball torture. It's going in the highlights. I, I just saw the clip counter uh, go up. No way! It knows, it, you know, an iPod just fucking knows, dude. It's scary. Um, <laughs> a lot of things, but really not. It's okay. You can always re-roll, you know. It might not be worse. Maybe. Maybe. It will fuck you over a lot though. Like, we just have to acknowledge it. Um. Shit. Oh, wait, I don't know where I wanna go actually. Fuck. Will I be fine here? Will the sun eat me up? I don't think so. Where was the fossil? Oh, actually, where is the signal? This is more important. Oh, somewhere on the hourglass twins. Very cool. Um, 
Vanilla Shimmy is not cooler, it's overrated. Over you. <laughs> <laughs> Concrete. Shiny. True. True. <laughs> Root <Rude> running. <laughs> Weep material for sure. Um. Anglerfish fossil. There it is. Ember twin. Okay. Ember twin. Ember twin. Ember twin. Ember twin. Got you. Got you. Got you. Got you. Not the ash twin. The other twin. No, the other twin. There we go. This is gonna be rough. These motherfuckers like orbiting the sun so closely. Uh, made it to the quantum moon yet? No. But we might. We. I think we kind of just like slurped clean the fucking uh, giant sleep of all the of all the knowledge. I think. We saw everything there was to see there. Some question marks about the uh, Bramble Island because I kind of just breezed past it. Um, because the cycle was about to end, and I just wanted to get shit in the log. So, yeah. All I got from that was that uh, Feldspar went to the planet's core. I think? I got the impression that he actually like made it inside. Um, but yeah, I don't think there's anything else to see on Giant's Leap. So now I'm trying to go to Ember Twin to find out about the funny fish skeleton. Uh. Did you go to the planet core? I, well, to the, to the, um, we saw the jellyfish. I collided with the, 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 the electrical barrier. I even tried to fucking do a drive-by on the jellyfish. But yeah, we didn't go any further than that. Two and Wolf, uh, thank you for the follow. Hello. Wait, why did that did that not pop a notification? That's weird. That I was already following you. I thought so too. I've seen your name before you for sure. Probably just Twitch being Twitch. You know, it happens. Uh, I don't know who Wilbur suit is. Twitch guy. Yeah, it it, it happens a lot. It happens a lot. Or maybe, full disclosure, you might have seen me just basically never fucking stream this game again because I only play it once a week. <laughs> and you just like unfollowed, which is fine, and forgot about it, which is completely fine. I totally understand. Um, let's put good fun to someone else. Uh, fish, 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 fish. Wilbur suit fish. There's a story there. And I feel like a, not an entirely legal one, somehow. Um, but yeah, I'm assuming that maybe the Feldspar person will tell me something about the core of... Did, can I? Okay. Let's try this. This is such a stupid idea to use on the fucking twins, but... You know? Let's give it a go. The story might... Maybe a summary? Assuming it's safe for Twitch. <laughs> As a boss of the Watch of Art in 34, you seem discouraged. So, oh! I'm sorry if it seemed that way. Maybe frustrated? Oh god, Jesus Christ. Okay, well... A bit too close. I knew it was a bad idea to use the autopilot. <laughs> um, but no, I can guarantee you, I've never been discouraged. Even today, where it seems like I kind of lost my mind. Because I realized I've spent like nine hours on Brittle Hollow. <laughs> 
And then I wake it to giant sleep and it's like, hmm. Here are these very basic instructions that make it seem like this is probably the planet you should have gone to first. <laughs> uh, even then, it's not frustrating at all for me. This is funny. Um, okay, let's try that again. In the dream SMP can a man in will pursue to fuck the Salmaga. Pregnant from that and gave birth to a fox human hybrid. Nature is beautiful. My goodness. Okay. Does it let me match the velocity at all? Can I do that? It seems to be doing it, but I'm getting so fucking iffy about doing this so close to the sun. Oh my god, I can see it in the corner of my eye. I don't like that. Hey, yo, what the fuck? Is yo, it's the... Oh, 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 it's the thing. It's the other... Um, it's the other shuttle. Oh. Are we okay? Did we- did we even fucking land? Okay, now we did. Death star moments. Oh, this is so scary. It's right there. What the fuck? Um... Holy shit. I'm also streaming for really long today, which is not typical. Because... Typically. There's other people in the house. Um, but right now, I am completely housekeeping. House sitting, not keeping. Well, I am kind of keeping the house as well. I gotta like clean and take care of the cats and all that. Death will be imminent in the event of a supernova, which is always imminent in itself, so. Constantly on the brink of death. Very fun. You're still alive? Hi, dragon! What's up, buddy? Ah, uh, fuck. Ultimate pog. We're doing some- we're, we're, we're video gaming. I legitimately do not feel tired in the slightest. It's actually kind of impressive. For me, personally. Uh, where can I read this? Church research notes. Property of Chirp. Clearly, the Namai were making astronomical observations here. They chose an excellent spot. What is this big rotating device for? Was What was it the Namai were observing? I'd posit there's something special about the orange symbol on that device. How in the new astro astronaut's translator tool should be... Nice to have. Oh, Rajib, thank you for the follow. I am so sorry. I don't think I have either of those commands functional. <laughs> uh, thank you for the follow, Rajib. Sorry. Um, cursed. My alerts are special, to be sure. I would love to show them off, but that would take me on another fucking tangent, and right now I'm very excited about learning more about this. Um, but I've made them all myself. Wait. What the fuck? Oh, okay. What do we have here? This planet sometimes, and only sometimes, has a moon. This is also of note, it disappears if no one is watching it. Is this where they found out about the quantum moon? Isn't that a fascinating orbital characteristic? <laughs> so, man, tell me about it. This is my first time encountering a natural satellite with the ability to vanish when not being watched. We should study it, or even better, we should travel there. So true, bestie. I agree! Our first step will be determining a method to track this phantom moon so we can always know where it is. I've read this already, haven't I? 
Given its reluctance to move while consciously observing, it might be a form of macroscopic quantum mechanics. I found your note. Mallory, kindly count me among this moon's admirers. What is this happening when it disappears? I doubt it ceases to exist. Does it move to another location? I believe so. Not only does the moon appear around Brittle Hollow, I can all confirm it sometimes orbits Timber Earth as well. I'm glad you enjoy them, Grim. I am a big fan of them personally. But they are all weeb material, so it is understandable that they're not to everyone's liking. The other things will allow me to buy truth <laughs> royal court jester. Anytime, Chad. Thank you for hanging out. Be safe out there. The quantum moon locator is functioning. We have markers for each of the places the moon goes. And on a bur I just observed the quantum moon in orbit around Dark Bramble. I added a marker for Dark Bramble. You have keen eyes, my friend. So this moon travels to a total of five locations, not four. But it's not just... I thought the locator now accounted for all the phantom moon's locations, but sometimes the locator can't tell where the moon is. Perhaps there's a problem with the device? It's also possible that there's a six, right, the sixth place in the star system which the phantom moon travels, and they found it. They found that sixth location because they, they fucking go there in the shuttle. Is... Is this the moon? It is! Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, okay. Interesting. Hmm. This game is so confusing to me. It's it, especially when you just when you're not like fully um, up to speed with everything going on. It can get very confusing. I totally get that. Um, I would love to explain, but there's I'm also like not. I'm too. <laughs> it, it it is like that. No idea what the fuck is happening. Space. Space is happening. Um, well, let's go to the shuttle. Whoa. That much I knew. Yeah, that's all you need to know. Then you co you completely up to speed. Nice. Okay. I've identified another signal. Space blasting. Hell yeah. Hell yeah! Oh. Oh. We need status reports for all systems, but initial things first. Is everyone unharmed? Our escape pod's passengers are afraid, but physically well. Nona, everyone survived the crash. This is a relief, at least. You have my gratitude. But were we able to find the escape pod's distress signals? I can hear both signals somewhere in the star system, but I don't believe either escape pod crashed on the same planet as us. Very true. So they did not. We knew this much. Ooh, there's another recorder there. What's all this, though? Uh, escape pod vessel 2 is more like that. Waiting departure from vessel. Escape pod 3, escape pod 2, collision imminent. Sterling environment is complete. Sterling temperature is pro prohibitively high. Inhospitable. Do not seek shelter on this planet surface. Hmm. Oh Christ. Uh, let me back in. On the walls? On God? Okay. The heat from the star system sun is much is more bearable below the surface. Makes sense. I should get you put it on it sound like World War 3 and wake up Jay, I'm sorry. Have you perhaps considered 
A sandwich? It doesn't need to be heated up. <clears throat> oh, shit. Hold on. Sorry, sorry for picking you guys up. Sorry. Okay, never mind. We're fine. We don't have bread, so just eat the other components of the sandwich. I don't see a problem. Is the camera okay? I had to pick it up there. Are you picking me up? I'm sorry. My camera... I have to keep reminding people. My camera is my phone. So every time I need to check my phone for like texts or anything like that, I have to pick up the camera. <laughs> um, when our escape pod punctured this planet's surface, it broke into what scans show is a cave system with much cooler air. I would recommend we seek sight... Seek a site down there to build a long-term shelter. But these passages are a maze. Even with this danger, they are still our best chance of survival. We'll form teams and descend into the caves to look for a shelter site. You can mark our findings on the walls to avoid becoming irreversibly lost. I can't fucking believe they put a labyrinth planet in this game. This is where I lose my mind. This is where I absolutely fucking lose it. I'm so bad with labyrinths. Um, today I read DLC's dick stream. You know? They're both extras. Um, be cautious, everyone. And be aware of the sand as you search. It appears to be rising gradually. You have got to be fucking shitting me. A labyrinth and sand. That's just great. Emergency escape hatch. That makes sense. Do not follow this tunnel to its end. Coleus and I will examine the horror that lies at the terminus later, provided we live. What the fuck? I mean, thanks. Keep, no keep moving, friends. There is nothing of interest at the end of this passage but rocks. And while these rocks are interesting, they can wait until a less urgent time. Thanks. Um. Yep, hurts. You gotta make sure. You know? You gotta make sure. We have found an enormous cavern at the end of this patch that appears promising. I believe we could construct long-term shelter there. Cavern Valerie found us a wide search for shelter. Why don't you mark directions for the others to follow? This is sort of the path to the shelter site. I've left directions to guide you there. Of note, we must hurry as the pathway there is filling with... <sighs> God fucking damn it. That's all I needed now. Sand. Fucking shit. <gasps> okay. Of note, this passage this passage leads to breathable air. Refill your supply tank there. We cannot tell how far or deep these tunnels may win may wind, but do not linger as the air is exposed to the heat of this alien sun. Oh pog! Refill your air supply and return quickly. Is it that bad? Our suit must be pog as hell then, because I don't see any indicators that we suffer at all from it. I'm incapable of seeing a fire. You have to make sure. It's like wondering about fall damage, you know? It's only natural to try it. You have to check. Otherwise, the possibility of it actually being safe will haunt you. This is terrifying. <gasps> okay. Okay. The 
path to the shelter side is somewhat convoluted, so follow the instructions ahead closely. Man, am I glad you guys have, like, fucking glow-in-the-dark markers or something. To reach the shelter... To reach the shelter side, walk forward until you meet the... Oh, fuck no. Walk forward until you meet the sandfall at the pit, then turn left. Continue to the room filled with rock column formations and climb upward through the opening above them. What? Walk forward from here until you reach the sand fall at the pit. Then turn left. Continue to the room filled with rock formations and climb upward through the opening above them. Go left. This is left, I think. I think I'm going left. Okay, rock formations. Oh. Okay, that's that. That, that wasn't so bad. I, am I speaking too soon? Pogger, wait. Be cautious crossing the chasm ahead. The bridge, Melroy, and I crafted will do its job, but it. <laughs> 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 yeah, tell me about it. Um, once on the far side, look for the tunnel. Once on the far side, look for the tunnel hidden behind the falling sand. Follow it and you'll reach the shelter side. Tunnel hidden behind the falling sand. Um, can I make it across? Okay. So you're saying that there's a tunnel behind here. Oh wait, so it is. So there <laughs> is. Cool. You're doing well. There's only a little far to the left. To go now until you reach the shelter side. You can rest there. Hurry before the sand comes. <laughs> Stop fucking threatening me with sand, bro. I hate it. Why would you do this? Y'all don't have fucking gardeners or something? You could clean out these fucking things and I have to. Man, I'm. You could. Playing golf here or something. God damn it. I. We made it. Easy. Easy clap. Poggers. Poggers. Where does this go? This is amazing. Look inside the cave. How did this come to rest here? We haven't encountered others in, the, in these caves. I think this is a rare find. From what we can see, Coleus and I believe the specimen must be very old indeed. Imagine what we- <gasps> Is this the fossil? Is this the fish? My both agreed and likely that this dry planet is the, is this horror's place of origins, but especially considering what we observed during the vessel's evacuation. Clearly this hole is too small for it to ha have fit through. Hypothesis. There is another entrance to the cave. If there is, Coleus and I will find it. We can't leave valuable information undiscovered. So true, bestie. An update. We need to find a way inside quickly. Malarai, because I returned here to search for an entrance to the cave, there are children. <laughs> <laughs> I will be the children playing with the specimen now. It is my turn. Gotta go to sleep so Jibon get Lonnie. Perfectly understood. Sleep well, Grim. Thank you for hanging <gasps> out. Um. Yeah, that's pretty scary. That is pretty scary. Agree as a stream, love you, love you too. Good night. Sleep well. Thank you for hanging out. Okay. Okay. Oh. 
Oi, oi, oi. It's archaeology time, gamers. What do we have here? Anglerfish Overlook District. Stepping Stone District. High Energy Lab Trailhead. I Shrine District. Should we build a sun station to power the Ash Twin project? Are there any other ways to generate this level of power? Theoretically, yes. Practically, no. I can't imagine discovering them in our lifetimes. I understand this proposal is unsettling, but the stun the the sun station must be built if we hope to complete the Ash Twin project. I almost can't comprehend this as being suggested seriously. The purpose of the stun station goes against every standard we hold ourselves to and everything will be the, what the... If we fail, and the probability of this is not insignificant, we will without question destroy ourselves, all life here, and the rest of the star system. I wish to protect these species. The potential annihilation of the entire star's star system is too severe a cost. We shouldn't build a sun station. But they did. It's that thing that's super close to the sun, isn't it? Fear of failure is a poor reason not to try. I believe if we're cautious, the sun station will work. I believe in Pi. I'm deeply honored, idea. I can comprehend your position. However, if we aren't all but certain the sun station will not cause destruction once we've built it, then I won't support the station's use. And surprisingly, idea, I disagree. We're pushing a possible new technology further than ever before. That, in my experience, is the defining characteristic of our species. So they did do it. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck no, dude. Why? Wait. Oh no, dude, no, 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 please. Please. Can I not? Oh god, oh Jesus Christ. Fuck. Fuck. Uh. Can I look at the fish? Wait, that was it, right? The overlook thing is just that thing I found earlier. Bro, I'm gonna fucking suffocate in sand, aren't I? And I just wanted to find the fucking entrance. Wait. Why? No! I hate this planet. I fucking hate this planet. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, how do I even get out of here now? I can't, can I? I'm just fucked. I'm literally just fucked. What a horrible way to die. Holy shit. I thought suffocating in outer space is probably the worst we'd get. But I hate this more. I hate this. Getting fucking buried in sand in a fucking tiny cave on an alien planet right next to the fucking sun. <sighs> That's not great. That's, that's not, that's not great. That's not great. Well, it's been real. Crunch.
at least right there, it didn't seem like they were sending back the memories of, like, the actual moment of the death, you know? That's kind of good. I wouldn't like that. Okay, never mind. I'm on crack. It's definitely going the same direction every time. I'm just, I'm just on crack. I thought it was changing. Ay, ay, ay. Wait, does this mean I have to make it through that fucking labyrinth every time? Surely there's another way in, right? Maybe you died from the O2 last in a second between your helmet cracking and your body. <laughs> The subtle sonic difference between the bone and the glass breaking. Poetry. Truly poetic. Okay. Sunless city. Holy shit. That's so morbid. The cable and angles of fish bottle, your opening is only big enough for my scouts. Oh, right, that's the one inside the Dark Bramble. Right, right, right. Um, the might of right to protect the edge to the project, and they did build it. They did build it. The might of us to the normal applied to the corner of the four microscopic under the moon traps a total of five. Six locations. Back to it. Again. I really need to get the hang of getting to there quickly. Either way. Because this is... Yet another time-gated planet. <laughs> It feels so weird to say from time gated planet. But I mean, it's true. The fucking sand. God, I really hope there's like a way into the city from outside or something. Without having to go through the fucking tunnel. I guess it wouldn't make that much sense for them to make it, because then it's like exposing to the heat or whatever. But still, man, they could just. Why not? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I did. Um, <laughs> didn't go well. A plus, I should get the hang of it anyway. Like, manually. I feel like if I rely too much on the autopilot, it's gonna bite me in the ass. I don't know why, but I get this feeling that it's gonna be good for me to... It's gonna be good for me to learn how to fucking... Uh, land manually. You can learn from it then. I, like, I've seen the process it goes through. Sort of, like it matches the velocity first, like lines it up all nice. 
and then it approaches and then it breaks before going in but man that's so much trouble <laughs> I just want to go in <sighs> I'll get the hang of it maybe possibly also hello vap88 how are you doing today I don't think I've seen you around here before See, the thing that I don't get is if I'm supposed to keep pressing the match velocity button. I think I am. I'm now realizing that I, 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 I am supposed to do that. Because sometimes it feels like by still holding it down, it's like fucking fighting back against the acceleration, and I can't do it very well. Even now, it feels like it's kind of like, oh my fucking god. Why? Wait, is- wait, is the- wait, is that why there's sand everywhere? Is the- oh my god, what is that? What are these planets, man? Is like, is the Ashen Twin just fucking sand pouring into the into the Amber Twin? That is a very toxic sibling relationship, if you ask me. Then again, they are siblings, so. How are they called again? Right, the Hourglass Twins. Right, right. Look, believe me on or not, I slipped, okay? Oh. <laughs> I promise I slipped there. It was not intentional. But wait. But wait. Does that mean... That as the loop goes on... The Ember Twin becomes submerged, and the Ash Twin becomes exposed. Ha! Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh! Oh! Of course, of course. Why? Why would it be? Why would it be an obstruct? <laughs> Wait. Oh. Wait. No, it's actually clear. I was like, did they really want to make sure? So they would put like also fucking ghost matter in there as well. Maybe those are different cacti that won't hurt you. Hmm, you know what? Hmm. Nope. <laughs> the same ones. <laughs> um. At the what? At the 
comet? What do you mean, comet? The interloper? I still don't know what that is exactly. I've crashed my ship once trying to get there. Um. <laughs> Yo, they got the drip! Holy shit! I fear our situation may be dire. Pi, Poke, and I have landed here in this combat not long after its arrival in the star system. Our shuttle's equipment heard strange energy readings coming from somewhere beneath the surface. Pi and Poke were able to locate a fissure in the ice on the common sunward side and they descended inside to investigate the source of the readings. But Pi and my sister have been gone for a long while now. They haven't contacted me since descending below the surface either. Should I leave the shuttle to look for them? I want to follow protocol, but I don't know what I'll do if they aren't well. Come back safely, my friends. What the fuck happened there? Hi, Jelani. Oh. Five thousand bars. Five seconds. Was that you, Jelani? I can't fucking tell because ah, I can see. There we go. I enable preview just in time. Thank you for the host. How are you doing, buddy? Shanzi Kek. So true. So true. Yes. Do check out Jelani Woods TV. We still don't know how these fucking things work, so I'm not gonna try again. <laughs> Who is Jelani Woods TV? Hmm. Man, why? <laughs> Mm, they're just giving me more questions. <sighs> God. How are you doing, though? What brings you here today? Uh, how do I... A smooth, uh, um, like a like a like a, a smooth launch, you know. I dare say that looked pretty fucking scuffed. <gasps> right, of course, it's the gravity cannon. Of course, of course. Will this? Ah, yes, it will. Um, are we shouting out streamer slash WoW Arena Warlord Jelani Woods TV? We sure are. We sure are. Speaking of shouting out, you know, speaking of shouting out, wait, Apex Legends? How did that go? Sorry, give me a second. Also. <laughs> oh god, no. It went horribly. <sighs> oh, 
play with Frozen and Dark Diamond and get a single win in five hours. I mean, it's a battle royale, you know? A win is very luck dependent. Not always entirely up to you. Actually, never entirely up to you. You know? Yeah, but we're not terrible at FPS games. Yeah, but it's... That was a very long time. <gasps> and a hundred dollars is a lot of money, and yet people will spend that much trying to get their waifus in Genshin Impact with no luck. It's actually not that long. Yeah. I think. Moderate. Wait, what do you mean there's more to see here? What am I supposed to fucking do with a broken shuttle? Okay. For VR, yeah, true. Fucking BRs take so long. That's one of the reasons why I don't like them. It's so much time. And it's so much time of, like, nothing. You know? Like, you can literally spend, like, a 20-minute match just f doing fuck all. <laughs> and then you get to, like, the last zone or ring or fucking crop circle or whatever the fuck trendy thing the game came up to set itself apart and there's like 50 people there and they all shoot at you simultaneously and you die yo wait it's not even fucking falling when the loop starts Interesting. That is so cool. Poggers gaming moment. Oh my god, where am I going? Where the fuck did I land? Hello? Where am I? Oh, okay, this is fine, I think. Um... Okay, this is the shuttle. <sighs> Do I have to go down there again? Uh, is there really no other way in? <laughs> uh, <laughs> also, isn't there like a billion fucking hackers in uh, Apex right now? This doesn't look like the bridge I went to before. This one's intact. What? What do you mean? Wait. Wait, huh? Okay. Friends, if you find any signs of Coleus, I implore you to tell me. He vanished without a trace during our research trip and has been missing ever since. How was young Coleus lost, Melray? It disappeared in the cave at the bottom of the day of the dry lake bed at the North Pole. It happened in an instant without warning. I turned away from Coleus to examine a sample, and when I turned back, he simply wasn't there anymore. He had a limited supply of air, and oh, I'm afraid for him. Hypothesis. We will learn more by examining the northern lake bed cave where Coleus has appeared. Search quickly, everyone. We have no time to squander. 
What the fuck? Someone's from some the city are here to help search for Collius. Can you tell us more about your expedition? Collius and I were studying the cave's geology. We hope to learn more about the unique one. <gasps> okay. Okay. F in a chat for Collius? But what? I mean, okay. <gasps> F in the chat for me, what the fuck happened there? That was new. What? The fuck? <laughs> Hello? I don't even know what happened there. Interesting. Could it the Ah. Oh. Damn. I wanted to make the funny sound again. Um Oh, I didn't know you could do this. Or this! Wow. Should have probably have looked at the top left of the fucking screen uh, sometime earlier, huh? <sighs> Could that. Mm, how though? Could that have had something to do with the quantum rocks? That would be weird. It would be a first too. Every other like instance of quantum stuff we've seen has not um, interacted with people. Poggers. Amogus. What the fuck is this thing? I feel like it's like electricity related or like power supply type beat. <laughs> God fucking damn it. I wasn't that close. What is this? What? No. You're not about to tell me that this is like the top of the city. And that there's also no way in. Oh, okay. It's not bad. This door will need to remain closed for some time. Pi and I are running an experiment based on the extraordinary findings in the White Hole Station. Romy and I will be running the experiment until one of us, specifically me, can prove the other wrong. So, although it's inconvenient, the lab currently can only be accessed by the path from, this <sighs> from the sunless city. An update. The high energy lab is now being used to redesign the Ash Twin project. If you're here to help or even just to observe, be sure to use the sunless city, sunless city path to the lab. Inviting sand and cyber to disrupt our setup it could have enormous consequences. We realize this is an intriguing prospect, but it's almost <laughs> remain closed nonetheless. Okay. Okay, very cool. I gotta get baited again. 
feel like I am. I, I feel like I am. I get this, 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 something under my skin. It'd be funny if this like electrocuted me. Oh. Maybe next time. Rub it off, man. It's just sand. <laughs> so how do we get past the ghost splooge? We don't. Um. Oh, I mean, this isn't the shortcut at all. This is bullshit. Ay ay ay. Fuck's sake. Okay, maybe if I do this enough times, it'll become like muscle memory, right? Something like that. Christ. Okay. Um, yeah, we don't get around the ghost splooge. Um, I'm not even sure if it actually like dissipates with time as I thought. Because we went back to look at information about it. Um, um, but what we did find is that you can actually see the visual field, which doesn't always correspond to the area covered by rocks. Um, you can see the field if you use a camera, and um, it, that's good because it really, sometimes there's a lot more leeway in navigating than what the crystals on the ground make it seem like. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're back here, it's not that hard, it's not that hard. It is a fucking pain in the ass though. So does this turn on the lights? Sure does. Okay, okay, now we know we gotta hurry. Um, what is this? Stepping stone cave, what the fuck? Man, I wish I was paying attention to what, uh, level each thing is. Wait, actually this might be it though. This game's- dude, this game is legitimately- it's so good. It's so good. It's really hard to properly express um, how the game is. Man, what the fuck? But yes, it's it's really, really good. And it does sound really good as well. The music is really chill. English is hard. It really is. It really is. English is hard. Hard fake language. Poggers. 
I have no idea where the fuck I am, where I'm going, what I'm doing. Are we playing the? F <gasps> Are we playing the fossil fish game tonight? I fed the fossil fish a new lantern. If you go to the stepping stone cave, the entrance to the fossil fish cave is easy to see now. Shit. Okay, go back to the cave, go back to the cave, go back to the cave. Uh... I can't see shit. It's fucking light. There's no light here. There. <laughs> the kid's fucking light. There probably is light. I'm just not going. What? The... Not going deep enough. I'm not going the right way. It gets so hard to like understand where I am here. have to go to the long way, but it isn't far. Go to the stepping stone cave and then up into the fossil fish cave. Try to get to the fossil fish through the step of the I couldn't find the entrance. Where is it? Target can't fit through the angle fish overlook anymore because he grew bigger. He's taller than Levy now. Remember to feed the fossil fish first if you go to the angle fish overlook and throw. Oh! Oh, so you're supposed to first, at the entrance, in that fucking little gap, you're supposed to toss in your fucking, um, scout. Into the fish's mouth. Which will then make it easier for you to see the entrance from the stepping stone shit. Gotcha. Fuck me, that's so much to do with so little time. God damn it. <laughs> oh. What's in here? Gravity cannon. Fuck off. This is closed, isn't it? Like walled off with the. Uh... Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Very cool. Uh. Nor is that an nice... True! True! I always do have an X loop. It's an interesting balance of like. Um. Pressure, but at the same time, it's also kind of liberating to know that, like, shit's just gonna reset anyway. So you don't need to, like, stress too much about, um, about, um, About, uh, about what? What am I thinking of here? Oh! Please, let me in. <gasps> about... Not again. It's gonna be the same shit again, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it is. Yes, yes. Yes. Is the- Okay, wait, no, this is new. Is the eye natural or artificial? Maybe someone built it. As all the neighbors is how I can- Wait, no. Could naturally occurring though, this does not answer how the eye could be as old as it is. Did the eye deliberately call out to us by sending the signal or did we hear the signal by coincidence? 
Could be seen meaning where there's none supposed to say it was produced deadly. Perhaps the eye meant to be found. Could it be sentient? Maybe it chose us. Does the eye desire something from us? Could it need us in some way? But it doesn't have to be us. Right. Right. We have seen this before. This guy's kind of starting a cult. Huh. Oh, that is really cool. <laughs> I like that. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, liberating. It's liberating to know that you can kind of just do whatever. And the notion of a point of no return is kind of meaningless. Even if you read like two sentences and then trip on your own dick and like fucking die, that's still progress. That's being recorded. You know? That's what I meant and that's what I mean by like liberating. Oh, there is an exit here. I'm so stupid. Holy shit. Um Dude. Can can I leave? That's not what I meant to do. I mean there sure is, buddy, but where though? Away. Oh my god. I'm gonna not. Holy shit, there is a way. There is a way, guys! We don't have to fucking. Get. Uh, um. GPS! Fucking GPS coordinates to navigate the cave system to get to the city. Where is this? I need to, to sear this, the image of this entrance into my skull. Okay. That's pretty easy to see, because it's like, you know, the thing is there, the cannon is there, and then it's like right across. That's good. That's, that's, that's good. I like that. I like that. Um, where's my ship? Okay, over there. It is big nuts. Colossal nuts. Yo, wait, is that the... Oh, look how much we can see of the Ashen Twin now. Yeah. I just noticed that. That's like some designer shit right there. Actually, it kind of looks like... It kind of looks like... It kind of look... Yeah, that's power shit. Isn't it? Am I, am I good here? <laughs> Is this fine? Holy shit! <laughs> sure. What the fuck is going on here? 
I don't know where I am. Sometimes passes I checked in with you. Pi, how are you and the Idegeek proceeding with progressing with the Sun Station plans? Presently, my assessment is that our plan will ex either fail explosively or <laughs> succeed explosively. You know I don't find that funny. I do. I think I'm like. And I don't recall regressing that you monitor this conversation idea. I don't see what state of matter you are has to do with this, and I don't recall supporting the sun station's construction, but here we are. Hypothesis, time spent away from the station would be beneficial to you both. I'm immensely interested in testing your both. <laughs> My god. <laughs> are they okay? <laughs> they, uh... I feel like they need some, uh... Some, like, professional help, you know? Got some things to... Got some things to sort out together. <sighs> Why? These guys can... Tr oh. The, am I dead? What? The fuck? Um... Oh, wait! I got caught in the sand! Traveling from one... Wait... Let me go. <laughs> Your ship. <laughs> goodbye. Um. Goodbye for real, actually. I can't get to it there now. Oh, wait, yeah, I can. Oh, <gasps> for a little bit. For a little... Wait. Wait. Am I... Wait, but didn't I park in... I, I guess I don't know what the trajectory of the sand is. Oh, it's going around in this... Why would you put the fucking... Man... Who built this planet? Oh. We good? We good? I think we're good. Poggers. Um. Oh, we're good in theory, but I don't know where the fuck this is. See, like, shit like this, right? If this was a game without its the time loop mechanic that it has. I probably would have never done this. I'd be too fucking scared. I'd be like, oh no, but what if I died? You're gonna die fucking anyway. You know? It gives you something liberating. But... I... I don't understand. I don't understand. You're not looking so good, buddy. There's a ghost matter there. Kind of weird. Uh, uh. Oh no, here we go. 
Maybe it's not ghost matter? Apparently. This might be interesting, actually. What if... Since I'm here... I'm, like, closer. Can I see the... I'm calling it the sun station. I don't know if it is, but... That's my working theory right now. If I could see it from here... And see some, like, sign of... Activity? That... Hmm, I can't see it from here. You know, I was thinking that like if it, if I could see it do something, it could give me an idea that the sun station was responsible for this happening too soon. But like... Hmm. Oh yeah, we- no, of course. But what I was saying was, like, because they're, ma they're making all this noise about how the sun station is like super dangerous, they're gonna like extinguish life and shit. And I'm thinking that that uh, structure that we can see closest to the sun is that sun station that they were talking about. And I was thinking that if from that point where I was on the ash train, um, if I could see the structure do something right as the sun is um, exploding, it could give me the idea that um, it could give me the idea that it's responsible for making the sun explode. Mm. I couldn't see it though, so there's that. But hey, we got a shortcut into the fucking city now. No more time. Oh my god, it's 1 a.m. Uh -huh. <laughs> shortcut, baby. Exactly. I've been live for almost eight hours. At 7 p.m. time isn't real. It's actually f uh, fucking uh, uh, 27 uh, DN. Who's Steve Jobs? Um, anyway. Eight hour stream, nothing matters. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I'm having too much fun. Several large Amai towers form a ring around Ashton's Ecuador. Really? Wow. Highly enlightening information. Oh, man. Eight hour vlog. Fuck. <laughs> uh, I am uploading all these to YouTube, by the way. Although they are enlisted. In a, in a specific playlist on my channel. But yeah. Fuck. God damn it. I have to I have to stop here. I have to now that I realize how late I am, it's like Ah oh, The fucking the sleep is setting in. 
I gotta remember that shortcut though. That's like the most important thing I found in this game. <laughs> That's not true, but God, it was the most satisfying thing to find for sure. That's not true. I also found the entrance to the fucking uh, tower. So I want to use it when I fall asleep, but I don't want to pavlo myself to sleep. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That would be powerful. That would be some like hypnosis type beat. Um Good God. Eight hours. What the fuck? Jesus. Is this the longest I've gone, I think? Some things that make me yawn whenever I hear them. Oh, I feel that. I feel that for sure. There's only some, okay, not that part, but I do have things that make me fall asleep. Um, give me a second here. The Joffy Chan. Yes, yes, I remember that. I remember that. Um, I was gonna say something, I forgot. Oh, yeah, I gotta like, yeah, just. Yeah, close out the stream. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop you guys off at. Um, <laughs> so. This is funny, right? I actually ran into this guy when I was um when I was in my one of my sessions of like playing Overwatch at like fucking 1 a.m. with my mic muted and queuing the PS. Um but yeah, I ran into this guy and he, and he was really chill even though I was on his team and I'm very sorry for that. Um, and yeah, he was streaming. So I was like, Hey, Pog. Um, so yeah, I'm going to drop you guys off there. Um, let me set this up. Oops. What the bad thing is was really, wait, I can't read the rest of that. It was really helpful tonight. I'm happy to hear that. And thank you everyone for coming by. I appreciate, uh, T T Toon Wolf <laughs> and Rajib for the follows. Uh, again, I have to stress this. I don't always play uh, Outer Wilds. Lately, I've been uh, streaming it only on Fridays. Um, not this long <laughs> also. I started 5 p.m. my time and go for like two hours and a half. Um, but yeah. I typically stream a lot of Overwatch and then I like to try things out. And this is one of the things that I've decided to try out. And I liked it so much that I've actually committed to um, fucking playing it all the way, which doesn't always happen. A lot of the times I drop stuff because I get bored of it or because I just decide to play it by myself offline. But Outer Wilds is special, so I've actually kept it up. Fridays for space exploration. Hell yeah. But yes, I appreciate your interest nonetheless. Um, yeah. Thank you everyone for watching today. Uh, thank you to Grim also for the raid. That was huge. And uh, for the hosts, which was Jelani and Kaz. Right. Yeah. I can't fucking see them in my notifications feed. Thanks, Twitch. Very cool. Um, but yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll be back. For sure on Monday, as usual. But I probably will stream at some point during the weekend as well. Because I got the house to myself. So no one can stop me. And uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. And see you next time. Bye. Sí, me viene ahí.
What's it called? Black Adam, I think? Incoming. Yo! Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> Hey, Shansi, yo, thanks so much for the raid, dude. How's it going? Holy shit, dude. Not really a surprise. Yo, Rod, thanks for the follows, dude. Yo, how's the stream, dude? How's the stream, Shansi? How's it going, bro? Yo, welcome, everyone. The name is Z, man from Scotland. I'm a tank, man. And I'll let you just play Overwatch. That's all I do, dude. 